So I assume it's mouse move. Oh. Beep boop. Ah. It's me. I'm alive, sort of. Oh. Well, that's a relief. What I missed. Looking. I see Chad enjoyed cat petting. Yeah, well, I talked about cats to them for a little bit. <laughs> Gotta give them pets. Yeah, cat isn't here now. She's downstairs having fun with curtains. You don't. You can't imagine the adventures you can have with curtains when you're a cat. <laughs> you just keep hiding behind them, running back and forth forever, and it's like an amazing new adventure every time. <laughs> no, I think she heard me. She's back now. Okay, she decides to chill around and just keep running around the house. Five a.m. like cats do. Okay, she has other ideas. Hang on. Probably. Let me try. Nope, because it's putting it. Where is she? He's like right there. Yeah. There you go, Bapu. There it is. <laughs> I was telling Chad about how I had a black cat who would play fetch. And then I posted about it online, and we came to a consensus that black cats love, love to play fetch for some reason. She's really intrigued by the camera. <laughs> uh, she's in yeah. play mode, pretty much. I mean, shoving it in her face, so. <laughs> it's not. No, it's like, it's zoomed in. It's not as on the face as it looks. She's just looking at it. It's a bit blowing like, on. Yeah, you're still wiggling it around. Yeah, it's just because I yeah I have to hold it on the small. Like, if I zoom out, you'll see it's a fair bit. Yeah. It's just, she's in active mode. She's paying attention to everything I do. It's hard to find a place to put this camera and point at her because she's right underneath the monitor. We'll figure it out. Eventually, we'll probably go back to sleep again. So the camera doesn't. Yeah, enough. Yeah, you can see it's like straight vertical down uh, one of my monitors. So. Enjoy cats. Pretty lady. Congratulations, your Sergeant Zior. One or. Yeah! And Taba. And Torchwood. I don't think he's here anymore. I thought Torch exploded. Apparently not. There's another Torch. Ah, yes. <laughs> I'm really surprised Angelus only had six kills. Yeah, he's been around since. A while, I guess. I guess he just got lucky and unlucky. Yeah. Let me look. How long has he been around? This... Eh, April. I mean, since the last stream, but not that long ago. Yeah, since most missions, he just hanged around the back. Zero kills, zero kills, zero kills. Yeah. Got lucky. No, oh, cat's gone. I'll bring my cat camels. She saddles on the spot. It's always a different spot every time. You need like, they need to make cameras proper for cats that you can just, like take anywhere, like a post-it. Who knows where they're gonna end up? And, like wide anywhere. Like magic. So I'm guessing chat decided on more XCOM. Which... Seems to be... Yeah. yeah. 
<clears throat> Fair enough. Can't argue with the cat. True. Get one of these battleships. Might be able to get a yeah, the adult sanctuary. Might be able to get a commander. Commander. Once we do that, we're basically we can basically be line side on this. We just have to keep. I guess more reason to not. Or I guess we can just get the commander from the base. I don't know which is. Uh, actually, the base is harder than we're a large UFO. But both are still pretty hard. But yeah. Either way, I think we have a perfect. Uh, Farming spot gear for when we need stuff. So, we'll see how it goes. Uh, this is the UFO Sidonia's Fall soundtrack. I should probably put that somewhere. I would ask about it. I'm lazy and I can't pull up mods in game, so I, that will just click. No. Chat. This is probably next to the XCOM Legacy DLC thing music. This is probably my next favorite remix. It's basically the original, but really biased up. It's not like completely different, but it's also a lot more XCOM. It's a really nice balance. all the ones people have done throughout the years. I can get these back in our spots so I can get the camera back. Hopefully we should see the Back to not being able to tear what, where <laughs> cat begins and chair. Trust me, there is a cat here. <laughs> Can't believe in it. Twitchy. <laughs> yeah. You can only see yeah, the cat if you're a pure part. Yeah. Usually, if I pull up the camera properties, it tries to. So it has like auto balancing stuff, which probably looks at a bunch of black and goes, wait a minute. <laughs> there we go, there's Kent. I should probably just. This... I like your spike cover up this part of the green, right? Cat's more important. Obviously. Bigger. Like the game should be like Bigger. poster snap sized and then the cat can be like Yeah. Like do the reverse of the face cam where the yeah. cat is the cam and the game yeah, is just there in we the go. corner. <laughs> yeah. Probably. I'm 
gonna do is just put put plasma beams on this one. Get rid of it. I was thinking if the other base was already ready, I could transfer the interceptor there to make room for the firestorm here. And that's gonna take a month. Uh, actually, interceptor is probably not critical right now, so I might just do that a whole lot to this for now. Just build other stuff with the materials we got, like suits. It might be a better idea. We can hold off on the firestorm for a bit, like this. These UFOs aren't going anywhere. We'll just try to get the landed ones, I guess. Months go pretty fast in this, so make them pretty easy. Commentary. Very insightful. That's what I do. <laughs> yeah, it's going, going, gone. Oh, I just did a little. What? Another muton? Ship on a base mission? Is the scout though? We should probably do something about that. Sounds like I should probably hi and say hi to everyone that showed up on chat while I was away. And thanks Zior and Kans for keeping them company. Too so much from both places. Shin, hello. I helped. Too much insightful to say. You had exciting cat facts. <laughs> Wait, did I? Oh crap, I think I. Yeah, um... Did I? No, oh, actually, I don't think I did anything. But I had taken out the weapons. I can tell the cat's there now because she's licking herself. <laughs> Confirmed for cat. If you had any doubts. Dan shouldn't eat over the ocean is fine, so I'm not gonna care much about the small. But most of the time I go I don't know where it goes. It's a system. I'm scouting for a setting up a base, I'm not sure I want it to set up somewhere. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch of them. Oh, that's... Oh, I have to do that at some point. Or could they be trying to set up a base though? Not sure. Oh, there's the black ship. Well, that might be useful for us, but... Does that mean the base is already there? Another mutant alien base that might be rough, but uh, uh, farming supply ships might be useful. So, you know, mutant supply ship will be a lot easier to insectoid once. So let's see how this goes. Let's see where it goes. Let's see how it goes. Our craft doing. Yeah, we have two people. Much armor. Some more flying suits, I guess those take a while to make. That's the other problem with flying suits. Shoot. Yeah, maybe I should. Actually, I have two workshops, I should buy more technicians. Oh, yeah, I finished researching. 
Well, last. Yeah, it's, it's the worst action. So, do you want to get him? I get plasma. No. Bullets. Oh yeah, we can equip. I guess I might free up some of you guys for the tank. We'll see how that goes. Tank might be useful when it's the brain missions. Let's track the sectoid brains. Should probably sell the laser rifles at this point. I think we should emergency be reactions. Yeah, you never know. I don't think they're they they can't shoot much besides sex at this point. But let's go follow that black dipsy where he's like heading. My hunch is correct, either it's looking for a base or the base already set up. So I wanna know where that base is gonna be. Line on over the No, it's damn near fast. I don't know where they would set up a base here in the ocean again. Doing the right maybe Oh wait, there it is. Yep. Oh, this was base too. They somehow managed to set up a base here. No, this no nothing interesting. So, first they set up a base here, and then here, and somehow they kept dodging this huge radar. Impressive. Knew this Philippines were up to something. So you can actually hear the whole thing because the TP uh, uh, remixer actually extended it a whole bunch. If I recall correctly, Just, you never get to hear more than a second of it. <laughs> He's the most metal gearist. God save me, Dave hate his voice is in Bloodstain too. Yep, he's exactly what do you expect? <laughs> I like how they just I got mean... him to be can you be your metal gearist? Hell yeah. He's a little less metal geary than I expected in that game actually. I mean, he well, still sounds David Hader as hell, but I don't think he's hamming it up quite as much as he did at Snake. Yeah, his whole role is still very edgelordy, though. Yeah. Yeah. He makes it work, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah he's the perfect voice for Zangetsu, no doubt about it, yeah. Like, what are my bets that if voice acting wasn't in that game, I would probably have read Zangetsu in David Hayter voice? No. <laughs> I think he did when he did the other Bloodstain. 
I mean, to be fair, uh, I was thinking I was doing like point. Nightblade from Saints Row more than I was doing David Hayter for him. Hmm. I mean, I think we did talk about how he was being voiced by Hayter at the time, so it is possible of an influence. Wasn't exactly something the Bloodstained crew was keeping secret. <laughs> yeah, I I love how you've probably I don't think you've seen most of it. I I love how so much of of Bloodstained is just a a middle finger to Konami, pretty much. Like yeah, they really I know what they were that. doing. It's pretty much just a love letter to Igarashi's work and basically nothing else. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, that's that sort of thing, like, after Konami got rid of David Hayter, uh, Metal Gear and stuff, they, like, they have no reason to put him in the game besides just, hell yeah. And all those sort of things. It's really good. Just like, yeah, we'll name an actual Castlevania game that has David Hayter. Didn't think yeah. he could. God, I forgot how long this track goes. I bet you never heard the whole thing. I like that canonically Solid Snake's first name is David, simply because he's so inseparable from David Hayter. <laughs> or at least he was before they changed him into Keith or Keith or Sutherland, whatever the hell. Keith Sutherland. Simply because the name had power on it, I suspect. Yeah. They even like remodeled his face, smash bar, the uh, piece other one. Yeah, it's a shame because I doubt even uh, Keith Sutherland had anything to do with it. It's just they, just, they wanted to yeah, probably change not, it up sure. for some reason. Keith Sutherland sold it a pretty good job. It's just, yeah. Point. Yeah, I mean, you could do worse as yeah. a voice for Snake than than Kiefer Sutherland for sure. But it's just not that. the same. Yeah, yeah. I hate when things much. change. Especially hate the when Konami thing changes is, things because Konami. I think the funny thing about it is, to me, is that like, it's kind of like Snake, it, like getting really old. Like, like it's it's big bosses. He's getting old. Like he's like in his fifties into sixties, which is you know who else David is getting Hayter older than his fifties and sixties? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, that was the first thing I noticed when I heard Zangetsu. Actually, it was, I said like immediately, like, "Wow, David Hayter is aging on us, isn't he?" Yeah. Places shit posting will never age. <laughs> Looks like it's up to me now. Yep. You gotta carry the. The shit posting. The <laughs> th I don't know what you. What trophy would be appropriate to pass down shit posting? A poop emoji, I guess. I'm gonna have to send an email to Vinny, send him, send him a video of me saying, Vinny, squeeze my hog. And... That'll do it. Yeah. Yep. That'll rocket me straight to stardom. God, I remember watching Vinny watch it. He was like, oh no, he's gonna do it. No, don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I have to imagine. And he would be like, "Hey, everybody! I got the best email I've ever received in my entire life. This is by Zior. We should all give him some money." Yes, give Zior all your money, <laughs> and the kids, but also Zior. Zior's a kid at heart. Trust me. Just, just mention farts, and he turns into a kid. <laughs> the fart charity. Fart charity. <laughs> There we go. Now we got it going. 46 hour Deep Rock Galactic stream for farts awareness. Uh, that's because I put the tank in the Sky Ranger. That's why there's less people. Bullet payoff? We're gonna find out. I've got, I'm, I'm just checking, I think. If anyone lost something besides their marbles, this piece should probably be here. I'm like putting stuff in the backpack. I think everyone's still pretty. I don't think Strandrons are going to do much against Mutons. Might keep them. 
Yeah. Sometimes it's if you're like a super min maxer, you might want to keep everyone slightly over equipped just to train up their strength set. I think that's how it works. Besides that, it's just yeah. Because the way stats work in the original like Thomas is literally the more you use them, the more better they get. It's, I guess it makes sense, but yeah, it's very grindy. Like hey, the more you carry, the more better you get carrying, but also. Usually you'll want the people that are already really good at caring to carry, so it's like uh, seems you want, like a like, bad system for this game. Yeah, I mean, yeah, but also with uh, at least it's not like some I don't know. It's like it's not even a system. It's just a little thing. Like it's not some more complicated leveling up whatever. It's just they the more they do a thing, the better they'll get it. So that's good, I guess. Like, it's, it's, it's mostly... easy and makes sense, but it, it just, it seems so wrong for a game where you're pretty much life expectancy is, oh yeah, you're just gonna hit the shitter. Yeah. Like, great. I'm glad you got three points in throwing. Yeah. It's so well, useful now. Given how many shots they miss, they're guaranteed to level up their accuracy. <laughs> because they try so hard. Anyway, is I think I was looking for something that fit what but I probably don't need a mind from Speedtoss, I don't have any plasmas, clips, yeah, yeah. I mean, if you try something a hundred times, you'll hopefully get better at it. Yep. Yeah, I, I think we're fine. I'll oh, it's a vanilla map too, and, it's, and there's already mutant there, so this is probably fine. Yeah, see, I put a, a tank here, that's why it is. No. Although, Muton can probably beat up a tank. We'll see how this goes. Oh, and the supply ship is right here, so. Yeah. Only shitty part about using tanks is, of course, you're not giving your soldiers precious XPs, but giving them precious more days to retirement. <laughs> That's on how you prioritize. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna shoot. On the from other here. hand, gonna try tank. And... Yeah, yeah so you're good. Ablative armor. Yeah. God damn it, you don't. Okay, I was thinking of trying to like to move the tank out of the way and try to shoot other people with it, but that would, uh, I think the tank is probably gonna die next turn. Oh well. Oh. Well, that was worth it. Long lived tank, I guess. <laughs> Yep. Worked it. Let's see, think of all the people I saved right there. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should have just moved it or ended and let it reaction fire. <laughs> I'm like, let me admit, at least we have tank now. Now we don't have tank. Well, it's the only outside of tank. Give room for other people to take shots. At least this mission seems more vanilla. Should have much trouble. It's just shoot a dude until they die. No psy shenanigans or whatever. Wait, wasn't this? Uh oh. Wait a minute. This is a supply ship. This is terror ship, I believe. So that means there's gonna be some salatid and you can select boss. That might make things a bit better. Not better, worse. There's some better in here. Well, we'll see. Well, same rules apply. Let's take over and take all the shots you can. Since the UFO is right here, I should probably hide behind it. Mission, so that might be a positive. <laughs> wow, rude. It's not four deaths, it's four lives we save. Wait, that cost a lot more than that, though. God damn it. 
you didn't even get to hear it go. Woo -woo 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 -woo. Real shame. Oh well. Maybe I'll make another one next time. Since now I'm actually farming all these UFOs. Someone shows up, oh, they show up. I think the doors are that way. Or they might just hang the ship. Hmm? Nope, there they are. I like the snake textures on the ground. That always amused me. Stationary snake features. It's funny how these vanilla maps are so simple and yet everyone remembers all the little details like oh, skellies and snakes and stuff on the map. Mm -hmm. I think some water is in the, the snakes amuse me, they're just stationary, just yeah. <laughs> ground it's objects. Existing, yeah. I think the modders have made them do damage. You walk on them. <laughs> it's for fun. Dude. Snakes are cool. Yeah, they're all right. The ones you can give boops. <laughs> snakes. Lucky with the shots there. Well, I think that I mean just downing a muton, not even just hitting them, but downing a muton one shot. It's pretty damn lucky.
walking up to the same spot. Nice. It's probably their pet finding at work. Well, at least the mutons are getting dropped reasonably. Yeah. It's funny how a game like XCOM makes the least threatening alien the one that's with a ton of HP and no other battle skills. I really does just make everything else worse. Like an alien that just takes a lot of shoots to shoot down, you, just, you start missing it. And plus, you it. gotta keep shooting. No, oh, now everyone's going, oh, this is going so well. Nah, no, you've done it. <laughs> Wait. Back. Five mutants rush out of the ship and murder everyone. Oh, there's one here, too. Is this a terror ship? I don't know. No, I'm not sure. I think it is. No. Huh. What ship is it then? Is that that? Wait a minute. No, it's not a supply ship. It's. It, it's just a shippy thingy? It is a supply ship, I forgot I have the random uh, floor pan, plan spot. That's why I was confused. Okay, that makes more sense. I return. I'm back. <laughs> Didn't really just just keep walking on their teammates' court, but like, <laughs> piling them up. Yep, there's another one. Just Keep standing above the other corpse. Yeah. Ooh. Survived. Long enough to return fire completely. Yeah, Jeez. you got lucky there. Not even any damage. I like why I named him Water, so I think Zero doesn't even budge when I mention him. Water, yeah. Dude. You're a doppelganger. Oh, yeah. But yeah, I looked it up and I'm pretty sure this is actually just another supply ship, so we should be. It's just I forgot they had the random map mod, so we shouldn't get any pesky anything besides some mutants, so that's nice. 
this will give us trouble, but not as much trouble as they could. Not like that alien base. Chad's got a point, he's kind of like AI in stealth games. You get someone down and now someone just comes. What happened here? <laughs> yes, there was nothing. Right enough, I suppose. fast. <laughs> that's uh -oh. five. <laughs> no, that's five of them unhappy about their predicament. Yep, and is one of them right above the lift? I guess so. Oh. I'll cure your panic, don't you worry. Wow, it's way up on the first floor. Hopefully it's one of the panicked ones, there might be more. Otherwise, gonna shoot me back. Wow, you shot straight up and you still missed. Amazing. I'm in breath. I probably shouldn't stay here. He might not panic. You never know when you. To be fair, you typically don't train to shoot straight up. Doesn't make me wonder if apply them up, shots, whatever, come back down. Or just go off into space. Just in case you probably shouldn't hang under there. In case they come back down angry if you're hitting their crotch. It's guaranteed to make well, them down angry. Like the principle of plasma weapons, as they were explained by the later XCOM games, is that like uh, they first project like a trail of ionized gases that the plasma follows. So presumably, like its maximum range would be however far that ionized gas column reaches, and then it probably dissipates after that range. Would be my guess. Yeah, yeah, they do. I'm well, so pretty sure guns. they don't train XCOM guys to shoot in any direction. <laughs> yeah, he's got you yeah. there. <laughs> Yeah, Pleasant in the new XCOM game seems to be something a bit more more thick, given they do like shotguns and stuff like that. Yeah. So, <laughs> do you do? Oh, that's a problem. Yeah, I don't like when they still have guns. It does make you wonder whose job is it to take these floors and make them sound more believable, but still not really. <laughs> because the explanations, if you've ever read UFOpedia in the original XCOM, are just complete bonkers. <laughs> the technical term. So I imagine someone looking at those and going, uh, can I make this maybe something? Scientific phrasing of bonkers. Bonkers. Yeah. Yeah. We know what we're referencing. Video. Yeah. H bomb is good. It's good kind of yeah. I actually used to play with him and a bunch of other people, Team Fortress 2, way back in the day. Because oh. we all came from the Something awful. Yeah, something awful forums. Like before everyone was an internet superstar. It's crazy how that happens. It's like, hey, I knew this guy, and now he probably doesn't even remember me at all. But hey, for that one time. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's kind of like when people randomly just run into Splap and like, hey, you the guy in the flash gun. It's like Splap to us. It's just a normal guy we've always known. Yeah. Today in the 90s, like this Flash glory days. It's weird how that oh. stuff just happens. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't even know that. I was like, yeah, I guess the first few times that we've like yeah. interacted in the Discord, yeah. Then I was like, somebody pointed out, like, oh, huh. I know yeah. a few people that would be jealous to know that. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, it was just like that kind of moment that was like, oh, that's neat. It's not anything I'm going to sit around and brag about, but like, oh, hey, that's neat. I know a few people that would be jealous. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just fascinating how if you're inside the circle, people, you just look completely normal and don't even think about it. But outside the circle, it's just like people completely different. It's, that weird yeah. position that's like because obviously all every person uh, famous is another guy but it's fascinating how suddenly without you doing anything special you just become this thing that other people suddenly you see different yeah and you're just like okay cool yeah i know him you know spam it's just the guy who drew a warm horse with teeth yeah i know him <laughs> <laughs> Much we all memorable. know it's true. Magnum Opus was horse warm. Yeah. The worm with so much heat. You can never count him. Uh, what shenanigans? Oh, this, I mean, well, everyone's panicking, so they should be fairly safe, but that's what I said last time. I didn't remember the snake man shot my butt, so I get too carried away here. At least this time I'm not trying to capture anyone. There's nothing to be gained from uh, mutant sites. Getting a closer look at their amazing spandex flags. <laughs> so, I think we all know. I, I know that sounds like the most important thing for science. Bear with me. Oh. Just how do they get to the walls? Andrew, green, purple. Yeah, it seems they're panicking less now, so we gotta be careful. It might be an arm. One was berserk, so there's still potential danger. It's kind of fascinating. Oh yeah, there's a dropped weapon. It's kind of fascinating uh, uh, about old XCOM. It's like when you start, you don't know exactly what you're dealing with, and it's like the more stuff you know, the more unknown it gets somehow. Because now you're like, okay, now I know there's five mutants. I know. Who has weapons? Who doesn't? Should I be more nervous, less nervous? It keeps getting more unpredictable somehow, the more you know. I guess to quote my mother, I know just enough to completely fuck me over. Yeah. <laughs> that is a good quote. Good life advice. There's one here, like in the lift. That. Okay. that sounded like a death. Yeah, sounds like one less. Okay. Oh, he was just on the teleporter. Yeah, literally on top of me. Yeah. Because <laughs> those things only give you line of sight straight up. So it's like interesting. That one might have still been holding the gun, so that's good. You... This one have dropped the gun, so let's hope that's a hard damage. I don't think there's any more out here. This is not as big as the mod maps, but the maps are fairly flat. <laughs> yep. Oh. yep, that guy is just, just chilling. Oh no, I jumped again. <laughs> like, no yeah. like, oh no, XCOM is here. I'm not prepared. It came ahead. Schedule. Oh gee, oh god, I'll be my, my weapon. Ah. Guys, I gotta be honest with you. I put in my two weeks notice the other day. I'm completely checked out. Oh, no, shot me, you a hole. <laughs> I just wanted to use the bathroom. 
Maybe that's what, what all the random rooms are. No. I don't think this guy is armed, but I can tell. So let's keep our fingers crossed until next turn. What's the worst he can do? Punch you? No, thank god they don't, because if they gave uh, mutons a, a punch, I'm sure it would be like a mech punch in the UI scum. Straight across the room. For a game that has the most boring melee possible, it's impressive how uh, little it usually is. Like the only things that have melee in this game are usually pretty mean. But all that looked like it's a sprite going. You're the zombie now. No, this guy's still armed. Let's fix that. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> nice. Again, it's always so satisfying when the XCOM shenanigans get turned against the game, you know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, stuff like that never gets old. Like, sometimes the enemies are the ones who get XCOM. Just two full deaths. Uh, let's stay in here for a bit. See if there's more out there. You... So this guy doesn't have a weapon. I... Yeah, I don't think so. I don't yeah, think so. Probably not. You never know what they're hiding in those specs. <laughs> oh, Herbie's still there. He's a dorky. Pink his pants. Call pink his non-pants. Yeah. Oh wow, and he's done. We might get him alive. Uh, let's make this. This probably isn't gonna go on much longer. I assume there's gonna be one. There's always one, in, like you know, the command room. Maybe. Yeah. Ooh, there he is. Oh, this one is <laughs> well, he is. Oh, no. Oh, there's oh. always one. Well, there you go. There's always one. As we've learned. I before. got XCOM. <laughs> yeah. Someone had to get XCOM. It couldn't be just a tank. I mean, it might as well be me, yeah. Yeah. God. There, you're gonna yeah. need a two for. <laughs> We're just gonna keep adding numbers. Or I guess I should just misspell it and call it the Tao. <laughs> no, the Zior, the Wen, the Tao, the Tre. We'll keep doing the War. War. <laughs> it's hard to mispronounce numbers now I think about it, because half the time just sounds like the number. I don't have a lot of syllable. It just makes me sound like I'm worse at English than usual. Okay, so if I go this way, I might be able to get him. Let's see. Anyone else here? Yeah, you. Oh, how the hell are you still alive, English? Well, we'll see how long that lasts. You... I'm pretty sure this guy's gonna be the last one. Let's keep looking. We never hang around this floor much for some reason. Maybe all the spooky stuff spooks them. Yeah, they just pay me to... Well, they pay me to go or not to hang around this weird stuff. What does it do? Nobody knows. For PA and stuff, probably. Yeah, Jesus, <laughs> all these mutants here in the floor. I was just standing on a pile of corpses. Yeah, that's, that's how time I would want to go. Just like, yeah, I did it. I'm a mature individual. Nobody tell time I did that. Would be forever ashamed. Yeah. He'll be promptly a phone blaner. He'll never give me sweet Warframe loots again. <laughs> God, 
this guy's gonna be a fucker, I can tell. There's always one. Always gotta be a fucker. Well, again, surround it. Might have a chance. We shall see. Something. I think it was English though. See, can you do it? Can he do it? You better, or you're probably dead. Uh, he might die if he moves. Let's, uh, fingers crossed. Oh, wow. Jeez. Oh, there's so many of them, it's and it's still not over. Uh, I hope that guy didn't wake up. I might have to go check on him. Uh, yeah, now that I think about it, I should probably go check on this guy. Yeah, maybe get someone out here in case someone's just chilling in the desert. Sunbathing. Yeah, I doubt there's gonna be any in this floor. If there's any more, they're probably still in the room. Hope. Just a okay. drink a bit. All the shoes. Yeah, you stand over there. I think it's this guy. Oh, yeah, it is. Just got up again. Figures. I have. Uh, if I had a stunt prod, I might try just poking him. Let's see. Any of you guys have a stunt prods? No. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother now. Probably not worth the effort. Wow. He got stunned again. He's stunned? Not dead. Yep. We stunned him once with bullets, well, with plasma. He woke up again, and the stun guy is just like, ah, oh, I'm having the vapors. I think we'll put him <laughs> down. Extremely unlikely stuff happened in this mission, and then, like, the most predictable thing possible happened to me specifically. Yep. Yep, we still got him alive. <laughs> Rattle with plasma, the most sleepiest of drugs. Bunch of Valyrian. Yep, yeah, it's another supply ship. So, yeah, as you can see, camping supply ships. Pretty good. Here's stats. It's been paying off for us now that they're closer to us, so that's nice. <laughs> Reason to keep these bases around for a bit. I definitely don't want to go in, on another. Elite base until we're better prepared because Mutant base is pretty That's rough, and again, we don't get much out of it. Insectoids, uh, if we want to get the commander, we'll have to be very well prepared. Let's see. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> the you. only death. Yep. Outstanding. It had to happen. So, yeah, I guess. So if you want sectoids, we'll have to raid probably a very large ship over here. Oh, there's another one. Right. Whoop, uh, my clock's rolled back, I believe. It's that day, isn't it? I was thinking it felt later than it was. Yeah, yeah I think now it's daylight for you guys, so now you're back in sync with us. Yep. Because yeah. we switched our clocks last weekend. Yeah. Oh, is that you know, you switched yours, yeah. 
I guess now it's 1 a.m. there. I guess that will probably help me in some way. Probably. Mostly just confuse me. <laughs> but yeah, that typing, that's been our best mission so far tonight. So. <laughs> Yay! ZR's dead, everyone. How was your lightning rod of bad luck? All of it went into me, so the rest of you could have a great mission. <laughs> <laughs> well, you and the tank. All right. The tank was a, a bad omen. Hey, I don't think we're gonna go on uh, under supply ship anytime soon. I don't think we need it. Maybe we'll just go pew pew it for funsies. I don't think they're too. Not far interceptor busy. I don't think they're too rough. I guess now we can research the mutants and spandex. Wait, they landed here? Don't tell me they're making another base over here. Let me go have a look. I thought supply ships only landed in bases. Guess not. I mean, this has bots, so that might do hundred enough. Yeah. Okay, now we have two farming spots. Okay. Wow, these are these crash sites still here? Maybe we should go do something. There's small UFOs, maybe we should just bug one of them at some point. Only well, hard crafts doing well now it's refueling. It's weird, I, I feel like they've been there for a while now. I guess a lot has been going on in the game. Yay! I guess the first flying suit, Torchwood. You have been the life the longest, I guess you deserve it. Let's see how that goes for you. Um, well, Snake Man Terror Ship. Let's see what we can do about that. Might be able to catch it before it starts the terror mission. Lots of plasma. The one person with the flying suit will be unharmed. Everyone else, rip. Yeah, it's the only other downside of manufacturing flying suits. It takes forever. Or just game's going really slow. I guess we can get them. It's too fast. It's probably gonna start the terror mission. And we all know how that's gonna go. Are they gonna go to Antarctica again? We're gonna find out in a bit. Yep, called it. Not McMurdo. Not oh, no. McMurdo. Probably the research station or something, but still. Why do these guys love Antarctica so much? Yeah, these missions in Antarctica are rough because it's a lot, uh, you know, the day night cycle is a lot longer, so it's hard to catch them. Uh, maybe we'll get lucky and catch them today. Yeah, but before that, more people to name. Let's see, how much people in chat? Shin, or mash. Did I already put it out? Okay. Maybe not. You tried to die, right? I'm sure you did. He does. You're a mod. That's a good name. Oh, 
Hopefully I didn't repeat anyone. Well, you're not going on a crystal mission yet. Maybe next time. Fleet type thing. Yeah, we're gonna catch it in the daytime. Huh, floaters? Supply ship? Have they make it another base? Oh, was it this one? Is this actually a floater base? Very confused by everything that's going on. So many bases are there. It would make more sense for this to be a floater base if it's one of the early ones, and that would give us a really nice way to get a commander because floaters are jumps. So if that turns out to be a floater alien base, that might be really good for us. Just have to hope really hard. No, I'm just gonna send someone to get a. Follow them, have a look. Got range of the anyway. Just see if it's going to the same base. If it is, that might be a floater base. That's good. Well, here we go. Uh, it's day mission at least. Better than the last one. Are you ready for a chrysalid? I have no idea what. Arctic map air maps of this are gonna be like, so we're gonna find out. Well, at least we're getting plenty of chrysalids tonight, it's everyone's favorite uh, terror mission. Uh, I don't know if you noticed, but the demo for XCOM is literally just a chrysalid terror mission. That was, if you had no idea what XCOM was, that was your first experience. <laughs> They knew what they were doing. Welcome to the demo. We are really going to find out if you are going to like XCOM. Yep. Yeah, okay, well. God, these suits are so to be looking. I mean, these are doofy looking, but in a different way. This is like comic book doofy. This is the something. Something else entirely. Uh, might be worth packing some spinner rods if we get close to. Cr I don't know. I don't remember how easy it is to turn a crystal or a snake man. If it's easier than just shooting them, uh, I'll just sp spread the rod around. You never know when you need a rod. Or stun actually, stun bombs might also be useful if you get a bunch of them in a the group. I never considered doing that. Like, not for capture, just for keeping them down. I guess we'll see. I've never. That's why I don't strategize. Makes me think about if it hurts too hard, and then my brain hurts. Play video games to think about stuff. Exactly. Oh, it's gotta rub those brain muscles together. All two of them. I don't think anyone can carry it, it's pretty heavy. Damn, it's a bit of round, we'll see what happens. Well, I do have more grenades at least this time, so that might be useful. Oh no, grenade too heavy. I think I want to get more D. Yeah, you can probably have. Yeah, that should be fine. See how this goes. Wow, I haven't seen. Wow, even though it's daytime, it's still dark. That's confusing. But I haven't seen this mod map before, so this is gonna be interesting. And. Ooh, speaking of grenades, we're gonna need them here, boss. We're gonna get with landed right in front of. It's a real. Uh, what's it called? Uh, the thing come to life. I think this is where it happened. I don't know if any of you have seen the thing, the movie. Mm -hmm. You should all watch it. Horror action y movie by John Carpenter. But yeah, basically it's a LED thing that pops up in an uh, Arctic base. So this is very. 
getting rid of that. So let's see, what do I shoot first? Oh, Snake Man, I could probably grenade. Crystal it can't shoot me back, so he's just gonna chill here. I'm just gonna take shots and see if I can get someone to grenade it there. Oh, if only I had the blaster bombs already. Because if I take a move, the Snake Man might shoot me back. <laughs> Let's see, I wonder if I can throw a grenade from here. Take one tap. It might go horribly wrong. Let's find out. Well, got one of them. Not a bad attempt. You might still make it if you're not bleeding completely out. Let's see if we can get the other one. Is it that crystal? I think it is. I don't. It's not as big of a deal because it can't shoot us back, so I can just take shots at him later. But let's see. Can I shoot him over these guys in the back? You. Let's see if you can like, clear out the other snake man so we have a clearer path. <laughs> Just one shot, one little shot, that's all I ask for. Bam. Has her flesh here. This grenade was kind of a waste, but eh. Grenades are always satisfying. Even if they're overkill. That was also good. Oh, so far so good. Uh, let's get someone. Medic. Check on this poor guy. Let's make sure he doesn't bleed out next turn. He's bleeding all out of his arm. It just won't stop. There we go. Ooh, yeah, that was... That was a lot. Hopefully you don't get shot next turn. Let's get some smokes here, because we're... For once, we're actually facing... Uh, actually... A bunch of map, not too much. We have any smokes? Where did I put smoke? Might have gotten rid of them at this point. They're not that useful, but... Oh, they're in the back. Well, we'll see how this goes. I clear this area out, so hopefully not more aliens won't show up. Hopefully you don't die again, dude. I already got pretty lucky. Oh, so there's gonna be civilians here distracting them, so they... That's the one advantage of having civilians around. They keep the aliens distracted while we can. Oh, or... We gotta go save the meat she and the civilians. That was a close call. Ooh. 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 Big of meat shields, Luder seems to be very attractive to the chrysalids all of a sudden. Jesus, that was a close one. Let's, uh, let's, let's, let's take care of this at least also. Let's... I'm probably gonna keep you there, so because you might get to uh, actually just step away a bit, just so you don't get reactioned. But if you're unarmed, that's better. Getting reactioned in the butt. Let's fix this. Uh, how about that? It was very close to a complete disaster. They had made it to the Sky Ranger. So let's put this away. Yeah, you can go back now. Please don't draw out any more chrysalis. So, get this guy in the back so I can get someone with time units in the front. Keep the uh, reactions going. You actually, you you have a flying suit. You should just get up here and avoid chrysalis completely. But the snake man might still take one shot at you. So for now, you can stay there. Just, uh, can I rotate you with someone that still has time units, maybe? I really want more people seeing what's going on out here. <laughs> yeah, like this. I don't want this near my ship. This is just bad news all around. Yeah, I think it's time to start getting you guys out of the ship and start shooting stuff, because this is all too close. I don't like it. 
Okay, I broke a security camera by throwing a dude at it. I'm happy about that. <laughs> nice. Okay, that's one less. Let's see if we can do something about that, says zombie. Move these guys out of the way. Can you maybe shoot him from here? Unlucky. No. No, you might not have enough time beats, goddammit. Grenades, maybe. I might just get someone else with more time units. Play it safe. Yeah. That's the opposite of safe, but sure. Well, hopefully. Civilian might be a distraction. But that means more zombies, that's not exactly the distraction I want. Let's just get you guys uh, as far as away as possible, probably. You might be able to do something. Ah, oh, geez, they're also here. Oh, we landed right in the middle of everything. Kill something. There we go. It's stunned, which isn't ideal because they still can come back and bite us, but it's keeping down for now. Just want to reduce the aliens as much as possible. Yeah, napping isn't. Great, but at least it keeps them off our backs for a turn. Two. Just have to keep an eye on, on them. Do I really wish you had your guns? Uh, well, some type of move. Where was the. What was the snake man? Oh, yeah. So, stop. <laughs> Probably just get out of the way. End up here. Just keep watch. So you clear the base, I think. Yeah. For others. I don't think they can get you here. I hope. So we can keep moving people out. Back there now. Get this zombie and one go. This might be a bad idea, but we'll see how it goes. Oh dear. Yeah, this might go bad. Oh. There's all these more. Keep bringing them all out. Everyone come shoot at the zombie. This would have been a good mission to have a tank on, now that I think about it. There we go. Okay, I think we got the... Okay, you can come back inside now. You can just... You can get your... Well, you can just... Just go somewhere. Go hide. have this in control for now. Okay. Uh -huh. 
there, there's nothing there, okay. So we seem to keep be keeping the chrysalis down. So, okay, who got shot? Are you injured? Somehow, no. And yeah, somehow this is still a night mission, even though it's not, it shouldn't be, I guess it's hard coded. It's annoying. Well, good thing I kept the flares on. So we know there's a dude just here. not be able to see it over the hill. Okay, now it was a flare. Yeah, flares make everything better. Okay. I said try to get him, not miss completely. Come on. Just the snake man. Get him. There we go. Didn't even see it, but it's cram. Good enough for me. Okay, let's start spreading you guys out so you don't get grenaded or something. We know there's more here. No, what else is out here? Let's play the safe. Flare them out. Yep. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Nope, 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 nope. Map really needs a lot of flares. God, do they hide the plate site? Let's get him. Get him. <laughs> they're kind of perfect for a map like this because they're basically just shades of black, and this map's just shades of well, shades of gray. This map uh, is shades of gray, so it's like really settling. <laughs> blood with the snow at least. Yeah. Yeah, I know there's yeah, I know. Just move a bit so you don't shoot someone please. This one less. So I have to remember this one here is done, so you have to keep an eye on that. Do the mistake I did as a kid and uh, put a a ton chrysalid in your backpack. Uh, you're not gonna like the outcome. Not even science is worth it. That one. The civilians are all still alive somehow. How bad the aliens are being. And good measure, let's get a flare out here. Oh, I, well, I guess they killed all of these. So they have been doing something. Okay, let's see. Let's spread you guys out a bit. You guys have a bunch of enemies. You don't get boked from nowhere. Yeah, Jesus. They're all around us somehow. Chuck, yeah, I guess the buildings haven't been distracted. Or, huh? Well, something happened. Not sure what. Got he shot back. I'm not sure wh what. You might be able to. Uh, no, so you have a wing in the way. Let's be able to shoot. That's. I want to say this, but you guys are almost making me proud. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Get, get them carried away here. <laughs> Mobile with three guys already cursing the squad. I'll say this just cursed squad. It's going pretty well. Yeah. Thanks. Why would you see this? 
You know what you're doing. I don't like how close together you guys are, but so far we managed to keep the aliens at bay, so... Let's hope it keeps going. Some are panicking, but not all of them yet, so... How oh, are there so many civilians in the Antarctica? How much violence are you guys doing in here? Clear like too much ions. It's beyond protocol. Please keep your science to yourselves. Now there's another one here, somewhere in these buildings. I to shoot out the tears from under the civilian. Okay, I'm sure I'll take it. So what if I get him out of the way? <laughs> oh, that's the tubes. Snake man we had spotted, no. Oh, gotta find what's left. And chat saying, You shut up the computer that had all the Arctic research data on it. Oh no, I've doomed science forever. I will never save Earth from something. Okay, seems like we're down to one panicky snake man, so we might be in luck. Question now is where the hell is he? This place has a million buildings. It's gonna suck. So many computer rooms. I hate to tell you this, I'm 
pretty sure shorts and shorts are not appropriate Arctic clothing. No, oh, that attitude. You sure? Clearly the white isn't from the shirts, it's just their, their chest is frozen in place. <laughs> Five flying sounds. What sound do we make the flying just? Guessing it's gonna be in one of these buildings. And this map is smaller than it looked. So, I find that there's not much left. Option to skip all civilian movement because who gives a shit? Or the door sounds, the metal sounds when they walk on metal floors, the screams, the button siphons, generic sci fi sounds like the button presses and stuff like that. Yeah, Just, the metal yeah. still stand out. Yeah, you'll hear a lot of these sounds for sure. There's some alchemy holes in the fridge I'm thinking about grabbing, but I'm not sure. I was real tempted to grab some rum, but somebody put it away and I just didn't care to take the effort to get it out. I'm too lazy to do an alcoholism. That's oh, my bro. day. <laughs> but now's the time. You're on the internet. <laughs> Internet's funniest home streams. Damn it, where's the snake man? Uh. Oh, speaking of the devil, don't shoot something that's not the snake man, please. It's a crap map and I don't like those reactions. I guess he got bored as well, because I'm pretty sure he's unarmed, yeah. Any thought of curiosity, any stun? What? Oh, also, this guy also woke up. That was lucky. They wake up without time units, I'm pretty sure. Because otherwise, this would have ended badly. That's two problems to deal with. So let's. Your problem number one. 
optimize right there. And you probably take one step away just in case. I don't trust the like reaction. Okay. There we go. Wow, did we really do that without yep. any losses and even save some civilians? Why? Not even a single zombie? No, wait, there was one zombie. What? I'm, I'm amazed. Total scores. <laughs> total scores still ends up about the same. I'm <laughs> super bad at this. <laughs> Damn. I'm sure my viewers are still disappointed. No chrysalid hygiene. Yeah, we came pretty close. This is a fairly small map compared to the last one. All well, of you did get ruin stats. a computer, so... Uh, I guess true. maybe it evens out. I guess it's a good thing they're distracted by Antarctica instead of an actual funding country. So I'll always be happy. Yes. Raleigh's knew some weird shit was going down there. <laughs> yeah, I guess I gotta go to Sidonia before things get worse. <laughs> well, hopefully, if my my current plan is if this is the floater bay, it might be our 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 ticket out of here. Otherwise, we might just have to go to the Sectoid base. Mm -hmm. Gonna be our ticket to something, all right. Huh? And there's anything. Oh, it's outside of radar, so I can't see the race. I'm guessing it's. Hopefully, it's floaters. Well, the problem is to get the It's kind of a catch 22. To get the labs, you need a sectoid. At least the leader. So you have to face Psy to get Psy or an Ethereum. So it's kind of twice so hard to get it. I guess it's your reward for surviving it. Shops for my little. Let's go have a quick look at our budget. How's that looking like? Uh, income, maintenance. We did this. And this? I don't know. It's the yeah, answer. Yeah, I think so far we're still making a profit. We should be. Damn, science is expensive. Three million dollars a month. Damn. Well, once we also once we start getting rid of these interceptors, it's yeah, it's so ridiculous how much you pay a month for having <laughs> renting uh, the basic crafts you have to pay monthly uh, for them, while the ones you make yourself or you, you don't have to pay any monthly costs. So it's not even like a main discuss, it's literally just, just paying rental to the government. The government. Capitalism. Yeah, Saving the world. Yeah, I guess it is very true. Yes. 
Oh yeah, good point. We probably have a bunch of stuff we can sell now. Time to sell all the corpses for science. Yeah, a bunch of plasmas. Maybe some more mind probes. Actually, mind probes don't show up more because they work a lot for something that's mostly useless. Oh, probably sell some of this junk too. These. Some plasmas. At this point, I think they mostly just have. Probably sell some heavy plasmas. Yeah, the heavy plasmas are worth a lot. And I don't think we're gonna get any more of these, so. Just bit. Yeah, that should give us a whole bunch of requests for money. I'm gonna hold on to these blaster launchers, so. though. Okay, this? Damn. Got unlucky with the blaster launcher research, it's taking forever. Because research times are also slightly randomized. No, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no, it's. Uh, yeah, no, on the sky. Uh, that's uh, 30 plasma clips. Actual heavy plasma, I only have 14. The stuff that shows up for sale is the extras, so yeah. Yeah, I saw some of those. You never know when stuff is gonna get blown up, so it's always useful we'll to have some stuff extra. But uh, I get your point. Don't need that many. It's easy money. We're not really strapped for cash, I just need to manage things better, speed up a bit, I guess. We got the engineers, so speed up hopefully. I mean, I have all this extra base space I'm not doing anything with, I guess I could eventually. Yay, blessed launchers! Please won't bring me over. And now we can go Oh on. yeah! Let's see what we got. Somehow or another, I feel like maybe a third of all of my blast from launcher shots ever were successful. Yeah. Well, I think I it's just. atrocious luck with those things. Yeah. I think it's just. You use the new XCOM where it usually goes where you tell it to, and then this one you have to be really crafty with your. Well, yeah, I know you finding. have to draw like a really specific path for it, but even so, yeah. it kept finding ways to blow up in my face. Yeah. I might as well skip to the ultimate craft, we're we'll eventually gonna need one of those. Yeah. Okay, there's anything super useful we need yet. And even if we don't go to Sidonia yet, we can always use it just to shove more soldiers into missions. So that's always useful. Yeah, more supply ships, safe. Good for our supplies for now. Check. Yeah, if we have a bunch of fusilier for now, might need. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need some more stores. Maybe some more orders. Set up for sight only at least. Get that done tonight, but at least get most of it there. Ah, uh, 69. Ah, funny number. Uh. Yuck. How far are we from the anger? I might just sell one of the interceptors, we're not going to be using them much. It's mostly just camping ships, we'll play with the money. Yeah, I'm just going to get rid of one of the interceptors. Just 
but full plasmas, one of these. Get rid of all the avalanches and start leveling this place up. Yeah, I should probably make some plasma in advance as well. Crap. It's gonna take a while, so might as well get it going. Oh, and then I didn't expect them to go. Oh. Alright, I still have this left. Get rid of you, except for two. And if we need another, we'll just transfer this. Then we can just start shooting ships for funsies now. Because we don't want to raid or score them. Ooh, very large belt. Oh, it's mutants. If it was a very large floater, stacked under something, I might uh, raid a very large battleship. This is asking for trouble. You are dope. I mean, you can't really shoot it down. Let's see what it's up to. Because it's not from this base. I'm wondering whether they have to. Because it's still an alien base mission. So I still can't tell if this is. Floater base or a muton base. So we're just gonna have to go in there and look and find out. Is there maybe more bases around here? Look. No, speak of the devil. What is this? Well, either there's a base here or they're trying to set one up. Maybe that's probably a terrible idea. What do you guys think? Should we go? Uh, should we go to a very large ship full of mutants? What do you guys think? Hmm. Have you had your fill of mutons? <clears throat> I said, have you had your fill of getting shot in the face by mutons? I don't know, chat does love when I get shot in the face. <laughs> I mean, they'll have plenty of loot, but we're not really starving for loot right now. Chat says, I'm sure they're gonna be all more death, more. <laughs> if I had to get shot in the face by one alien, it would be a mutant. I yeah. I guess we can at least have a look. If it seems awful, we'll just work. Let's have a little boxy. Worst case, I think they might, uh, we'll make them. Uh, part the mission, I think. So I might need the base bay. It's one of these maps again. I'm mostly concerned because it's nighttime. That's all we're gonna spend most of our time in the UFO anyway, so it's not a huge concern. Uh, it's just annoying. Although we're facing the edge again, so. Okay, let's enter it once, see what we got. Probably all in the UFO, sounds of it. We might get lucky like we got on the last Mutant ship and I'll just go scurrying out. Let's see. All the ship's here. We're gonna need a lot of flares. Let's just have a quick look see. Oh, I forgot to equip the extra flying suits. Oh well. Extra resistance might have come in handy, not so much in the flying in this case. I guess. Where is where is where is Muton? Where is Fincher of Green here? Maybe you should sell with this cursor. Yeah, this is over next call. Yeah, it's the next 
jump. Mostly vanilla-ish. Some map, just some map mods. Different maps. Okay, he's... Wow, he's really well disguised, I guess. He's in this hill, apparently. <laughs> Can't even... I don't know if he's just like... In... He might just be in a... I think there's like a little cubby hole here. A little thing right here. I think that's what it is. No. Nope. For the best. Okay. That was the best. Well done. <laughs> Good hoping. Yeah. At least you have the most odds of surviving a reaction shot, so I watch my odds there. Oh, we also forgot to. Oh, I forgot two things to put on the ship. Uh, it was that and the blaster launchers that could have been useful against mutants, although not so much in the UFO. That probably could just blow our faces off, but. Eh. Playing it carefully, we'll see how this goes. So if I can get a f another flare out here, might be useful. At the end of the day, uh, mutants are manageable if you play it safe, it's just when they stop playing it. Start firing the blasters. And things get hairy. Should come out around here. So we might be able to get some of them. Lucky. We have a lot of cover in this case. Bit of heals, but not as much last time in there, down. Okay, do we have any? I think we can throw a grenade because it's another UFO. Hopefully, it's hard to tell, but hopefully, this kill will give us. Similar strategy to last time, where we just, just go around the hill, keep shooting at dudes from the entrance, and once it's safe, start going inside. Just make a shame it's not a floater or even a tactile battle or something. I can sneak out of this. Yeah. I use flares. You see a dark spot where you probably an alien? Put a flare on it. All will be revealed. You probably won't like it though. It is never good news. It's just bad news. Can't confirm. Basically, you just don't get good news in this game. No. The mutant green is. Brad does the, the camouflage pretty well this game. I'll give them that. The green and purple are very terrainy colors. Want the flares give away my dudes? The aliens don't care, they can see everything. They're not affected by your pesky human knight. We might as well just spam flares everywhere. 
in vanilla leaf pods, obviously, might change that. Ooh. Oh. Well, there goes the J, J Shadow. Still seems the best strategy is just camping to exit, getting as many as possible. Getting too deep. As long as we can out out shoot them. Pretty good odds. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's why I never see a, the red mutants, because they figured they didn't camouflage well. Yeah, you just get them. I'll be right back. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sadly, let's just keep let's keep slowly moving in on the ship, keeping it because this is the only end point. So they're all gonna come from this direction. That's where we have to go anyway. Maybe get someone on the hill. I get someone. Oof, that's a long I might get a flyer. Yeah, that's quite easy to get the flying dude up here. Although with the UFO I'm not sure how much you can see, but we'll see. Through the flying suit, that's some rough luck. What's that? Salatid? I didn't think battleships had salatids. Select game. And I'm nervous about keeping these people out in the open when there's a light piece somewhere here. There's actually a passage here. The only other annoying thing self that's going to float, we might have the brand on us here. It's annoying. Keep ourselves with the tight end. See if we can reaction. Out. I didn't know 
battleships could have teleports, that's a bit more problematic. <laughs> up here I'm gonna be so mad. I'm sure I can get up there. Grenade maybe. <laughs> no, there goes the player. Not by one, I know. Can't get that flare now. Yeah, for some reason the seal is only climbable from the back. It's weird. So we know there's a teleted somewhere out here, which is fine. Pressing B to ship. Just have to move in. That's just. Risky. That's one of the problems with the battleship. It's got this big choke point where aliens can easily shoot you from above or below. Like, like this, wide open. It's usually want to get in and try to find a corner. 
corner. I hope they don't sneak up on you. Yeah, they do love throwing them down the lift too. I'm more nervous about whatever it's felt it's um, just killed somewhere. Like the way you just killed them. one of my flying suits again. damage and fucking mutons at this point. Since they like float and fly and stuff. Art, I forgot, come on. Thar, you gotta put a stop to this menace and it's stealing all our top two. Stop, man. Hopefully oh, yeah, that's the only one. You gotta work for that promotion. Everyone on the ship. don't want to hang around the lift too much, that's a big... It's a big choking point and a big black point. Like, it's also bad against the aliens, but usually they can... They got the brick of hand. I don't know what <laughs> Lieutenant Gorman. I don't know if that's a good. I don't know the reference. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. But I'll take it. Do you know Cans? What's the top of my head? Hmm. Not off the top of my head, anyway. Not great. I mean, it seems to be aliens for reference, which is uh, probably why it went over my head. I mean, I'll take it.
Ah, I see. Well, like I said, I'll take it. <laughs> People know what they tune in for, so... It is exactly that. Tama, second. You had it coming. I mean, Jesus. A lot of bullets, not a single hit. Come on, man. Money. I bet Brimcom can finish him off. Tama does talk about a lot about how bad his aim is, so. Oh, Jesus. There's another one. Oh, gee. Can you baby get photo of the. You're so bing. No. Well, first get this one, I guess. Here. I'm back. Okay. I'm back. You just I had to stop to tell the Daisy because she asked very politely. Yeah, I know it is. I mean, you saw how it is. <laughs> the minute now, you know why every time I leave the seat, I only come back hours later. <laughs> uh, the mods I have installed is just the music mod, and the curing, and the terrain pack for mixing up the maps. And that's it. Everything else is vanilla. I can actually make out some features in your kit. Yeah, that's how you know it's uh, getting daytime over here. <laughs> Six in the morning, yeah. Seven now, yeah. I was gonna say later than that, I think. Yeah. Seven, right? Yeah. Of the time chain, yeah. Yeah. Voids can only be spotted in daytime. At night, it's it's doom. Even with like, I do have like all the, I've had the, all the lights in my room on this whole time, and they still blend in. <laughs> I think that's just because cameras are a lot better with daylight and sunlight and artificial light. I'm gonna go with the explanation that the cat absorbs all visible light. That too. Works for me. Anyway, can you not die? How many I might maybe not die, please? Stop. Jesus, the mutant is tough. Okay, you got. Oh, yeah, this guy shot you, but he's already dead, so you can maybe finish him off. I'm. I was really waiting for him to shoot the other guy. I I took one step to the left, okay? <laughs> That's my bets there. But yeah, he, uh, where was he? I don't think you can see him. That thing. No, wait, yeah, Tama here, the second, died. Oh. Bravely. Uh, after missing the muton a lot. I mean, to be fair, it was a very tough muton. Was this? I don't remember if this was Tom or Tom or Tom or Tom. No. Been a lot going on. No. Speaking of, can you? No, you're gonna have to turn and then can't take the auto shot. I'm not gonna risk a snap shot on the mute so let's, let's hope he misses it. You might have a chance. Let's see. Come on. So that might be. No, I think that's just a rifle. I think it's a must launcher. I believe they still have a Come on, come on, come on. Okay, we're good. Uh, I'm streaming from Portugal. So that's a GMT time zone. So it's currently 7.30 a.m. here. And yeah, I mean, same man. I mean, I'm... I made up an X and I'm still not bored of playing this, so...
clearly. And you, you guys are still not bored of seeing me feel horribly at it, so you're in good okay. company. Uh, no, thanks for the donation. I think that's the first non-anonymous donation we've had for a while, so thanks for that. Something about extra life always messes something up every year, and this year it seems to be all the donations are coming in anonymously. It's all a mystery. At least they're presumably not getting hacked this year. Yeah. DDoS, I mean. Yeah. yeah, that was. Cat got the tail on her face. Well, that wasn't entirely their fault, so. Yeah, not entirely. Most adorable cat ball. <laughs> oh, God. Game, what did you do? I just launched the game and it's already ruined my day. Alright, hang on. <laughs> that sounds like Warframe. Yeah. I think he's talking about XCOM. 1920 by 1080 is me, right? Yeah. yeah. There we go. Oh, right, yeah, it's an old game. It's probably, yeah, it still doesn't know resolutions. Okay, so I think we cleared all the mutants we had spot, so now all that's left is a, a known. So this can only end well. I mean, so far it's gone better than expected. I just, just didn't expect a single pelleted to fuck up half my spot. And so definitely. I didn't, I didn't know battleships could have terror units. No, I actually had it. Uh, yeah, I actually are. Yeah. Well, I didn't know, didn't remember. Now that I think about it, yeah, because usually I just get them with like sectoids and floaters, which is usually not that much. Damn, I forgot XCOM's soundtrack was so good, though. Like, uh, Enemy Within, I mean. Yeah. Uh, I believe the uh, XCOM enemy. Uh, unknown and within soundtrack is by what's his name? Uh, Michael McCann, which is the guy that did the soundtrack for the new Deus Ex game, so it's pretty good. Uh huh. Uh, pretty sci fi ish. Yeah, I remember being decent. Yeah. Kinda didn't expect him to pull someone like that to a very sci fi technique for something like XCOM, and it works. It's not like this. Uh, atmospheric moody sort of style, which they uh, went more into in XCOM 2. It's uh, still pretty good. Mm -hmm. It's more actiony. So like Sky Ranger lands, and then like four people come out of it and just start throwing smoke grenades everywhere. Like both of them, like all of them, come out of the Sky Ranger with a smoke grenade in each hand. He's a wing it. Yeah, sounds about right. <laughs> That's all. Oh god damn it! That was just mean mutant hiding behind the oh, alien piggies. Oh, that's Steph. Yeah. Oof. Sorry, Steph. I'll let you know. Yeah, in the original XCOM, you can spam smoke like that because you, the engine can only handle like up to fifty or sixty or something smoke tiles. No, no, open XCOM, everyone just goes hog wild. Smoke for everyone! I'll avenge you, Steph. Somehow. Oh no. I will not avenge you. Maybe <laughs> next time. I sure blew up a bunch of probably important stuff, though. Hopefully. You're gonna say, valuable. maybe not a perfectly successful revenge, and yet awesome in its own right. Fear firing an out, uh, firing yeah, f firing an okay, auto shot here. Maybe an aim shot, maybe, but like maybe uh, the don't problem is, auto. yeah, it probably won't get him down. Just make him angry, and then I'm stuck here. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hang over here. I think, and we'll try again next turn. If he comes out, we'll shoot him in the butt, maybe. Aim shots would be taunts definitely don't pay off. Take one shot, and spend all your time, and then you can't run away. Just get it down. You always want to want a bit of escape route. Uh, escape route. 
So we still haven't gotten up here. We need to go check out what's going on up here. Because it's probably bad news. As we've established, it is always bad news. But it's less, uh, less open than this floor, so might as well. All the bears have knives. Yeah. That... Oh, what the hell is that? Where did you come from? Yeah, see? Not going in was a better plan. Some of just went, eh. I'll deal with him later. Although he's still in a safe position there. I didn't shoot him. Luckily, this doesn't block line of sight. Now I need you. What? I hate these oh, things. Whoa. I'm like, just being reminded of the D chat with the bear talk. God damn it! Was like, what was it? All I hear is just Sawako just yelling about like dummy thick bears, and I'm just like, oh, what did I walk in on? The most Sawako and Lin combo conversation of the fuck that I just walk into. You just watch the look intro away. of Enemy Within and I'm just remembering the immense satisfaction of getting a bunch of uh, headshots on the loss with a revolver in XCOM 2 and I'm like... Argh. Hopefully the last one's gonna be up here or here. Or actually, it's still a lot of places to check out, but hopefully things are starting to be more under our control. I think. Okay. I'll be right back. Need to use the restroom and all that. Okay. Watch out for the bears. They die. Well, they can't see it. <laughs> well, there goes Zar. So, wait, how the hell did you not see it? In solidarity with your game, I too will place my base in Africa. Get him! Get him! Please get him. Simon says get him. Didn't get him. Mm. So disappointed. Brought shame on your family. It's gonna be bad news for you, I'm afraid. What the hell is this room? Kind of heating hole? Pilot ship thingy? Scientific term. Because I'm guessing the last ones are probably. Yeah, this is, I think, the main room, so the last ones are probably gonna be here. Fucking my shit up. Let's see how many more do I still have? I probably need to get more people from outside. Here. I think so. Speaking of bad ideas. What? There, what? There's someone in the engine room, I think. They, I didn't even think they could hide there. And wow, he shot this dude in the butt. It's down there. What? No. No. Can you please? No? Actually, you might just be better off running away. Mother of God, look at this frame rate. Next Cause... gen gaming is here. So I don't. Uh, wait. Uh, I better not. 
I don't think you have a lot of chances with that much plating and stuff. Get someone else there, maybe. Hopefully, you won't peek out. Oh man, he's right by the goodies. Now I'm gonna get more people from outside, I guess. really angry at your butt there, Brimcon. I don't know how or why, but maybe, maybe let him without bleeding your guts out. Wow, you still managed to get him. Okay, let's get your medic quick for you. Oof. Oof. You, uh, who has a med kit? You might have one. Yeah, just, just drop it. Got some blood in you, don't you, Sylvia? <laughs> Just the right amount of blood. If medically speaking, you still have blood, we still need you to come into work. Doctor, please. We need to inject healing. There we go. Good news, soldier. You're not gonna die yet. For this reason, yeah. at this time. Yeah, I won't write any letters to my. I won't write any letters to your parents just yet. Let's see how this checks out. Face probably is gonna hit one of these fingers and go, and you know that's not a good sound. <laughs> Let's hang back for now. Find another route, see where he goes. Get more, yeah, let's get our people up here. shooting but we'll see how it goes. Let's get the B team in here. If mutants are bad news bears can we call solitudes danger balloons? I'll allow it. 
Well, personally, I just call them freaky beanies, freaky beans, freaky floaty beanies. Because goddamn, they're as harmless as they look. They are a pain in the ass. Like at least mutons. You look at a muton, you you know that's trouble. You look at the salatids, you just, just go, what the fuck? Bit at the your face, technically. It's what a horrible way to die. Okay, so let's okay, see where he went. Good old middle official Stanford. I haven't seen this guy in a while. Oh, yeah. when he still had his sweater. Mm -hmm. Remember that DLC campaign in XCOM 2? Yeah. It's a yeah. great ending. The entire thing ended up being a big friggin' shit post. It was great. I wasn't even mad. Yeah, no, that's that's pretty much the perfect way to end it, really. It really sold the whole is Brad Burt's making shit up. <laughs> the way I only get Brad Burt good. I know you're the commander, you don't even know. You aren't there. Shane went through. Do you have any idea how chilly you can get out there without my blazer? Yeah, it's great. The, the Bradford's sweater has always been a big uh, meme in the community, so it's great that they just went and made that whole DLC. Uh, really appreciate it. And sweater like breath with those. The source of his powers. Ink. Oh, well, there's a dude. It's a guy thing yeah, there. It's me. Hey, Gans. I was hey. talking about the mutant, but also, hey, I, I think yeah. you died while you were gone, I'm sorry. It was very ah. bad. Every time someone goes AFK, they die, it's amazing. It keeps <laughs> happening. I, I think, in fact, I think you were this guy, like, he, he got right up in your face and just filled you full of plasma. It was bad. Ah, okay, that sounds like an adequate death. Yeah, it wasn't like a just, oh, he fumbled and he shot you back. No, he really had it out for you. We had we've had worse deaths here, for sure. We had people shot in the butt. We had people not shot in the butt. It's, so it's crazy that, that is even possible. Okay, there we go. How do they even fire the gun with his butt? No one will ever know. Okay, he so far he has this mutant has remained elusive. So have we? Not onto us yet, so that's good. Let's slowly see if he comes up from anywhere around here. He's gotta be in his little. Again, they love their, their little command rooms. So let's just get closer. Where? Oh, that was monkey. Not oh, so much for my plan. How did he go from here to there without anyone here seeing him? Like, you were right there. Help. Bitch games, please. I think that monkey died without doing a damn thing, too. Just. No, I am slain. Oh, there's still more. Advantage. But there's still a more. <laughs> Gotta be nice well, uh, let's see. Game threw me a bone early on. I'll have easy access to a steam tile to build a generator in. Nice. Yeah, it's always nice when you get one of them right off the bat. <laughs> oh, 
Well, at least I think you're the first one that was still around when you died, monkey, so... Congratulations! You got to see yourself, though, in the most glorious of fashions. Well, yeah, it wasn't even the same guy. It's not like, where are these guys? Where are these mutants coming from? Also, were you? No. Why is your aim so bad? You didn't even get shot or anything. Still more, but that's also I, I didn't think this, these walls were destructible. Hmm. Uh, better put back here. I'm this close to using you, MIG. Good thing you on the PA system, you maniacs. I'm the commander. I will look forward to mission control when I, the commander, am good and damn ready. Damn it. You don't command the commander. I command. I'm commander. Stop it. Okay, who's here? There's gotta be someone in here. No? Black Flake, where is he? I'm gonna have to go looking. I know there's other rooms, but... Usually this, this, this as, as you saw, it's like a funny spot for them. What was he? Looks like these things still block line of sight even when they're down. That's weird. Well, time to search every room. Hopefully he's not outside. That's another thing about mutants you saw. All the other races usually once we get this point. Start panicking like crazy. Mutants not so much. We did get a few the other time, but I think it's the only time so far. They've seen some shit. Some apps. So what rooms are left? Uh, might be one of them in the engines, I guess. Sometimes it happens. Which sucks. I don't want to shoot my precious minerals. My Illyrium. I gotta replay this act sometime, that was a good game. Oh, oh, wait a minute, yep. I'm doing this wrong. I need to make this guy not me because I need to make myself a mech trooper. <laughs> I called it someone in another engine. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Better come out. I won't. Don't make me come down there and shoot the thing. This guy can be cans, how's that? I forget who I made it in uh, New XCOM. I had a bunch of you guys in there at some point, I think. My XCOM 2 roster was on point, man. I had some good guys set up in that. Where'd he go? The, what? Oh, is he hiding behind the engine? I hate it when they do that. Be hiding behind the engine, isn't it? Yeah, there you go. Hopefully, he hasn't spotted me. Does these things block line of sight like you wouldn't believe? I don't want to shoot it. Oh, yeah. Those things that are like you know, and yeah. pole diameter completely yeah. block all sight. Maybe it's the glow, it just blinds you. Must be. You can't look directly at it. Sounds about right. Uh, he might die. Yep. But he died for 40 costs. Which was getting the fucking alien out of hiding. God, what a pain in the butt. That's a really bullshit death, but... Uh, there's still more. Never gonna go to a Muton battleship again. Waste of good soldiers at this point. It's good streaming material though, so I had to. It's not an actual game. 
of not worth it, for sure. When you're starting XCOM, usually you just go to every mission and get, you know, every mission helps, but to get to this point, not every mission helps. You can definitely just, you know, just go do some pew pews and that's good enough. Good enough in here. Whatever I'm happy. <sighs> I'm gonna have to look in every engine now. There's probably someone in another engine. Yeah. A dick. I mean, we found two so far. Gotta be another one. Or else I should I probably need to keep an eye on this. Well, he's gonna be stunned, but there's a girl that looks. Just keep an eye on him in case he wakes up. Well, you say that, but we managed to do the fucking snake terror mission not losing anyone. And we do something like this, and it's like you just never know when how luck's gonna roll in original XCOM. There's never any middle ground, it's either you lose a whole bunch of guys, or just nothing. It's, it's wild. Okay, so why are we missing still the engine room? No, you what class do you go. want your clown to be in my game, Super? I forget what classes are there in the original. Sniper, heavy, uh, uh, support, and... Support and assault, right? Clyde, yeah, assault. Eh, make me a heavy if you have the option. All right. Like heavies. Uh, make things go explode. First heavy is a lady who got like half exploded during that mission, but she'll she'll get it. I'll work you in there somewhere. Yeah, that's fine. Monkey can be the sniper. Yeah, I'm just check. always shotgun. That that's just the rule of life. Just ask Ollie. <laughs> I mean, shotguns are pretty good in UX. No? Mm -hmm. You get the right uh, parks. You, you can you get pretty mean with them. Yeah, I just remember in Ollie's playthrough of it, um, he made every assault class me. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you wow. He went through Kansas like I went through Zeors, yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, there was like four of them by the end of the game. <laughs> they still keep dinging me over the PA the entire time. Commander to mission control. I'm just like, hmm, what shade of purple do I give you? This one's Already too got bright. in this ship. Christ. And they're all feeling very mean today, too. Easy, how are you still so full of piss and vinegar? I already played with you. Can I... No, that's actually a waste. I'm specifically I mean, play with you to try to burn some of that energy off. It's still bothering on me. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna keep you back, actually. Cause... My cat needs a hobby. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna, I mean, gonna teach her to put does. Legos together. <laughs> like, your aim is piss poor, so I think I'm, I'm not gonna use it just yet. I'm just gonna get everyone else up here. Well, first, just in case, let me check the fucking last engine. I'm gonna be real mad. There's someone hiding in here. Oh, we know that there's uh, dudes over there. Where is Kate? Dudes on an alien ship just shooting at me. It's the worst. Let's see. 
Trust you to be able to throw a grenade at bar honestly, but uh not many times. You might have a chance, let's see. Yeah, you can throw it a bit and step out of line of sight. Might do something. Might also fuck up my mineral at this point. Yeah. Good effort. Go back. So like, I don't think these things are super important. At least that's one appeal of these battleships. The Illyrium's pretty out of the way, while in the spy ships it's pretty easy to hit it. Explosives. Yeah, okay, who can I catch? They didn't even have anything to say to me. They just kept calling me because they wanted me to scan for activity. I know that button's there. You can relax. Okay, I'm gonna keep you guys like here. All the way back here. Just stay frosty. These guys are really pulling mean. Okay, now you might have a chance with the auto shot actually. Even with your pistol aim, because you're pretty close. No, he gave it a bonus effort, honestly. Uh, better move you a bit first. Yeah, we'll scoot over. There we go. What? Uh. Isn't it direct? Oh, it's one wipe now. Nice. Yay! We did it, and we only suffered almost catastrophic losses. Yay! <laughs> Worth it, I'm sure. Excellent! We lost five, nine people. Amazing! <laughs> pretty good loots, I guess. Yeah, some battleships have pretty good loot. They're just. I mean, they have technically they have the best loot. It's just a lot more costly than getting a supply ship, as you've seen. But, you know, some of you lived, four of you. Apparently, you'll be want to tell tales. <laughs> we'll up some military players. All of these you should rip. Torchwood, yeah, Olish, Tama, yeah. Shadow, Shadow, Staff. All, all of, the all cool of the, people. I like all of the. <laughs> all of Stairs Club died in one go. Stripped. <laughs> you were clearly lost without my leadership. Yeah. Oh well. That's my role in Stairs Club. I direct everybody all the time. Yeah, that's how that works. Recognize that snooze posture. She's like half awake. I just suspects that there's something she needs to be listening to. You talking about my cat? Yeah. I don't think I have any. 
someone else wants to do like start a stream right now, so I might just wrap it up at this point. You've seen plenty of I think uh actually let me see how close the mic's getting like sight on the image too. Well, that I might have taken up the torch if I had done any sort of prep whatsoever for it. No, yeah, no, it's don't worry about it. I'm just thinking yeah. of the how close am I to sight on you? That alien base has a floater commander. I don't even have a chance. Uh, Come so far, though. Yeah. But it's like, I'm just thinking if it takes a, a long time to get sight on you, it might not be worth it. If I can wrap this up, I might keep this going for a few more hours, maybe. You get this. Or will he save it for the thrilling closing finale? Yeah, I mean, I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked the minute I get side on here, but. We'll see how it goes. Either whether I win or I lose, it's gonna be glorious. We'll see. We'll see. If this is a floater base, we might have a quick route side on you. If it's not, then I might do a podcast. Any true mutons uh, or well, sectoid base is going to be a pain, but we'll see. That's my best here. Yeah, I'm not going for 24 hours, however long it takes to wrap this up at least. We'll see. Hopefully not too much. Might take another food break though. Eventually. Yeah, I mean, you know, pace yourself. But... Yeah. I get a bigger graft, I can put some tanks in there, then I'll probably break. Let me see how quickly I can wrap this up. Yeah, the space cells can be together, I think it's probably gonna take a while. Not much happens here, just pretty much just a camping base, keep an eye out on this. It's gonna do anything spooky over there, okay? I'm watching. Should have put maybe another base here, but then at this point, let's just try and grab this up. Let's see who else can we name? I think I've named the trivial already. Uh, I think I can name Colin. Get in here. What else have <laughs> we got? That's a good name. I like it. I named all the last people in chat. I'm just gonna open the chat. Let's see, let's see if anyone will look at least like a bot. If if I don't see you, feel free to speak out. Otherwise, I'm just gonna see who stands out. Or at least who... Oh, yeah, I haven't named Web I remember he said a thing at some point. Uh, let's see. Nice wizard, that's a good name. I think. I'm gonna put you in because I, I like like it's not ice wizard, it's ice wizard. That's good. Yeah, be sure meta is another TV or bots. Yeah. 
none of these are bots. If you're a bot, you gotta tell me the rule. <laughs> Not that it matters much, but... Got 17 viewers. I'm sure you'll pick all the right ones. Some of you are real, maybe. They're not in my head. Yeah, I recognize some of these names. Maybe I should put them in a bit. What I recognize. I want to, but I want to seem like I'm being preferential or something. Pretty sure. Must sound like for people listening to me at 8 a.m. going, You seem real. <laughs> Definitely on an illusion, my creepy mind at this point. Right. I think it's gonna sort of. Wait, have I put Pedro, Pedro, Pedro per zero? I think you already. Yeah, I think you already here and died. You'll come back if I get bored, I guess. <laughs> The making the fire stone. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna need more. I can make more fire uh, plasma cannons later. So let's. Actually, I should just. I'm gonna do a little cheat. I'm oh, no. just gonna take a, a peek at the base and see if it's a floater base. If it's not, so we're gonna need. Uh, two. No, oh, there is not. Oh. One of these is a floater base, and one of these is a muton base, so now we know. Oh, now we know there's two bases. Uh, I need to find out which one's the floater base. Three, or. There's floater, floater commander, and then maybe there are. That should be an easy win. If, if there isn't, we might be in trouble. So I'm sure there's two bait that there's going. Pretty sure. Uh, one of these has to be floaters. Let me just have a quick look. See, so yeah, ignore everything that's happening. I'm just gonna confirm my suspicion real quick. They're both mutant bases. Just, you know. Okay. Nope. It's. I was correct. This is a, fl a floater base. So we got lucky. Oh. Sorry, nice. mobile temperature guy. It's fine, none of this happened, as you can see. <laughs> but it was a dream. Yeah, it was all a dream. Don't worry about it. It's a quick one. Right, but okay. That's definitely a floater base if we get that commander. He's my pal. We can go to Sidonia if we can. I should confirm if that's. Uh, let me check the research tree. If the floater commander counts, I know they don't count size stuff. But it would be nice to get size stuff, but uh, we'll wing it, we'll break some tanks. Yeah, any commander. Dang. This might be our ticket out of here. Either way, a floater base is our best bet with not fucking ass, so you know. Gonna know my limits. I think that's gonna be our plan. Wow, Baez is all over the place, huh? Yeah, it's like the month and Okay, the alien base, yep. So this is actually I can name these so I'm gonna make it out. This uh Muton base. Yeah, I don't know if you knew, but you can rename these. Just handy for the sort of that. Is this floater? <laughs> Bad news. This is sectoid. Should I just blow everyone's mind like that? You can call them dumb things if you want. I just I didn't think it's handy for taking notes, basically. Because I, I thought about just giving you a way to know what's in the bases or whatever, but I figured just letting you name them. Like, find out for yourself and that's, uh, notes is more interesting. 
and it ties in with how you can rename everything anyway, so it's easier to add. Yeah, that's that's only in OpenXCOM. We let you rename the bases, the uh, alien bases, the crafts. That's all OpenXCOM. Originally, you can only rename your small gears. Use bases, I guess. Here, we'll let you rename whatever you want. You want to rename your craft? Do it. <laughs> want to rename your soldiers? Do it. Name your bases? Do it. It's all good. Stuff, so I might as well feed myself. No, it goes. armor then you can right click that's another open next no shortcut if you don't know if you pick one armor you can let's go through so you don't have to keep popping up the yeah, the dialogue every time you yeah you're one that you don't need Psh, gonna need more armor this right well you guys can take off the first I'm probably gonna want to make some tanks once I go to a Cydonia, but I think for this we should be fine. Nope, oh, Cat has left the building. Rip. I'm probably gonna have to BRB in a bit. Give her some good stuff. Right. Just, uh... Actually, yeah, I should probably get some. Because the alien base is gonna be a while. So. Private and it's alive. It's gonna be BRB for a bit. In like half an hour. Take care of myself and I'll be back and see if I can wrap this up soon tonight. So you get your chances to get a few drinks and everything before we go raiding the floater base for a commander. We'll see how that goes. Hopefully it goes according to plan. It might not go according. Being here with me all this time, we'll see how much longer I can go. Yeah, not a problem.
Right, Monkey and Cannon both survived that mission. Did lose a rookie. I'm sick. We got the mailed though. Overall, good mission. got promoted to uh, support, sorry. Yeah, it happens. It's got Keith Thompson to support. His assault, I mean. took a hit and continued to kick ass nevertheless so I award you the medal of reasonable adequacy sounds befitting yeah to be fair I can imagine getting Mabinogi working on Linux would be a headache it's a headache just to get working on Windows I was gonna say that. That cheat hook. for a little while. But they'll be alright. Why? 
I haven't used those organs anyway. Yeah, you still got some ribs. You're good. Yeah. Be right back. I'm back. Welcome back. Keep thinking about grabbing that can of hard lemonade I had in the fridge, but like, it's already stupid late and it's a huge can. I'd be miserable by the end of it. Yeah, that sounds about right. We saved that for tomorrow. I did threaten to see if I could get Space Station 13 out for working. Yeah, sounds like a good time. I thought about maybe seeing if I could grab a build of uh, Goon Station instead of TG Station, but I don't know. Yeah, I think it would be too much of an adjustment. We're also used to, you know, what we know. Even if they do change what we know from build to build to keep people from getting used to it. Yeah, I was going to say, pretty much because of that, I don't think there's going to be... I don't think it'd be that much different at this point. I feel like I tried Goon Station once, like, briefly, and it had some hard... I had a hard time integrating with it for whatever reason. Hmm. 
Segment I mean, says publicly available built to Goon Station. We're also seriously out of date. All right, well, I'll just stick with TGA Station then. Yeah, I just saw TG Station got, uh, I, like, accidentally opened a link to the chemistry guide, gone through my browser for something, and it appears that they've dramatically overhauled, like, entirely how chemistry works. Yes. It's, like, granular down to, like, heat and liquid purity. Yikes. It's, it's old boy. I mean, like, heat was always important, but, you know, like, there was, like, five or six things that you could do with it. So... Legitimately, really, the only reason I was thinking about possibly Goon Station is the fart key. Like, it really seems like Zior Station should have a fart key. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> Alas. Find the code and then patch it into the bed. <laughs> That's all you gotta do.
It quite suddenly got disgustingly cold around here. Uh, the temperature, yeah. broadly speaking, couldn't seem to make up its mind for a little while. Like some some days we were still hitting 70. And right now it's 27 degrees up. Yeah, we had frosts as of two days ago. Well, two days ago. We'll start to get frost. Let me calculate that, you Europe types. That is almost three degrees below in Celsius. Shit, cybernetics labs are cheap. Getting in on the robots early. I think I'm just gonna make that assault guy's soup, and then I'll probably be done naming people until I make myself a robot. Yeah, it does seem like it's struggling to get up to 50 during the day lately. Like a big wave of cold to hit us pretty suddenly. Pretty much only make really frumpy looking dudes in XCOM 1, I gotta say.
you know what I'm going to put Tama in here. Tama's going to beat Heavy, even though the Heavy is a woman. I'm just going to base it on Tama's Warframe Operator. It'll be fine. Just pink everything. Pink as hell. As ever with Monster Hunter. Good chunk of the game is just doing cat fashion. Good. <sighs> Maybe that's actually too pink even for fake Tama. There we go, perfect. I never made a default loadout for Hell Muppet. I need Hell Muppet loadout. I don't even want to know what that means. I think I've definitely posted it. a screenshot of it in the Discord at some point. In the Monster Hunter chat. Yeah, you barely have to scroll up. <laughs> it's right there. Hell Muppet. It really is just a Hell Muppet. weapon because it like actually like hid in the uh or I'll give you the orb.
Nice shooting, Kent. So Kans is not an assault class, but you would not know that by the amount of ass he's been kicking. <laughs> I'll take it. So bad in the panic from already. <laughs> I'm never thinking I would have asked Soup to uh, <laughs> show my <laughs> Discord stream on um, this stream so there'd be something to look at.
looking at some muscle buck guy with the XCOM soldier blowout hairdo. I'm like, yep, yeah, there he is, the suit. That's him.
Bali. Ah. Ah. Oh no. I know it's horrible. We just finished back. You know, back talking. It's fine. Yep, he's here. I've defied your wishes and made you the assault guy. <gasps> but you've been doing pretty well at it so far, so. Yeah, it's fair enough. So well, I gave you a medal of reasonable. Uh, oh, adequacy. God, I forgot about the medals. Yeah. So far, I've created the medal of reasonable adequacy and the medal of considerable. Medal of considerable okayness. Nobody has earned the Medal of Considerable Okayness yet. Well, I'm all prepped up. Time for the final stretch. If we can get that commander, neither yeah, this. fail miserably or win also miserably. So this is, wow. Tiny scout, really? Friendly trash? Eh, might as well win. Pew pew! I'm just gonna disappear instantly, but they had it coming. I can't damn it, I didn't push the button fast enough. Can't believe I'm not even gonna get one last pew pew. We already have a robo lab. So to make the robo zior. I'm gonna use this. <laughs> I'm gonna use this Canadian guy. It's gonna be Canadian robot zior. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. It just is. That's all right. I have blaster launchers now. Probably not gonna use them against floaters, but get them ship so I don't get next time. What's I wanna get? It was blaster launchers and something, something. No, we're definitely gonna need those mind probes, though. So. Plus, if we're they can probably even get the stun rods out. And stun launchers. Stun launchers, I think, these. Well, I mean, they still fire plasma so it should be okay. Also, whoops, sorry about that. I forgot to remove the intermission. Well, you haven't missed much, it's just me managing, so. The globe moved around, so. and not die. Hopefully you guys won't all die. We need to get some XP for it. I'm just gonna go there with a bunch of rookies. Oh, Alright, let's go. Pokey thingy. Let me equip these blaster. Figure out who should carry them. Switch. You ever wanna? Let's see, you guys are guys in the front. Oh, 
Flares might still be useful since it's an alien base. some random people or have some prayer room IQ. The orb. Well, it was literally just an orb. And we have a oh, yes, okay. And now I think I'm gonna hold on blaster launches for this. I don't wanna waste them on something like floaters. Wanna save them again. Morning Rectus. Yep. It's morning now. Up to 13 hours. So we'll see if I can finish this. Up I'm probably going to. Actually, I, should, I don't use the smokes anymore. I should put them away. I thought I had more heavy clips than this. I'm gonna need extras. Put some grenades around. Where the other mine probe? Yeah, this is probably fine. I probably shouldn't have people with both stun plus mic probes here. Light up a bit. Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah, maybe just keep you. I have a 
bunch of stuff. Process is fine. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, you can carry a bunch, you might as well just. Fuzzy dinosaur. Wow, a bunch of them. Wow, a lot of them. Oh, coming up to AI. Hell, I forgot about those things. They walk funny, don't they? Oh yeah, those. I think I died to one of those on one of the streams. In uh, Enemy Unknown here, I just encountered the cloaking tentacle guys that sneak up on you. I mean, the winning strategy against them is just to put everybody on Overwatch for a turn, but... Oh, yeah, the weird dude just hang out in the ships. How does Monkey not have squad sight yet? That was a nice thing about XCOM 2. Snipers have squad sight, like, intrinsically in that one. Yeah, it was kind of... They were kind of the worst snipers without them. Well, I guess they were basically just pistoliers, but yeah, it's very different. Okay, so there's there was a bunch of things here. Maybe I should throw a grenade. Give 
me a second. Kitty asking for pet. When you can watch them aim at the thing and then like juke their gun like 40 degrees in the wrong direction and miss. I'm gonna need you to do that again, but without all the sucking. Okay, come over here. Baby. Baby, don't do yourself in the face next time, huh? So, more repairs around here, be sure. <laughs> Start probing those. I doubt that was the floater commander, but still need to remember to start probing. Let's get someone with the orb on orb duty. Let's see who's got the orb. You man, if you have a flying stick, you shouldn't be on orb, orb duty, but yeah, might as well Let's see who else. There was someone in the front with the orb. Yeah, you, yeah, you're wounded. I'm gonna put you on orb duty and probably back. Dan's you've been tentacled twice, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. It's alright, he's fine. Probably. Kit, so you can heal yourself. You're good. The med kit washed away all of your tentacle trauma. You're fine. Good. Never speak of it again. <laughs> None of this ever happened. Fuzzy dummy. They still take a couple of hits, but otherwise it's mostly harmless. You head back here. You did your duty. You blew your arm off. Good enough. <laughs> Couldn't ask for anything better. Let 
let's see. Where if I was the commander, where would I be? That felt good. Best of this fight doesn't, but you know. Getting a full dragon piercer off at one time, this feels good. Escape from Tama. The room I'm thinking of is that. I think it is, yeah. Yeah. Wow, this is already the third room, so we might get lucky and just snap a commander, maybe not even clear the base, just get the hell out. I guess we might as well clear the base, get some stuff. Flutters are too bad. Let's see how this goes. It can be a bit gutsy, uh, but not too much. You guys do need to make me that for all, though. So clearing out a base might do some good. Glad that the mission that I put myself on so I could regain a rank and be eligible for Mech Trooper was called Operation Red Vengeance. Yeah, missions you have some great names. Also, in this room sometimes you can select commander. Let me see. Or a leader at least. That's the one I'm thinking of. Yeah, there might be. We'll see. Yeah, usually it's these two type of rooms. The command center and this, whatever you call it, has all the other rooms connected. So you usually have the big boys. Well, power coding. So now you know. And they all spawned right next to this is art, but that's convenient. Just have to hope we don't immediately kill them, and they don't immediately kill us. It's win-win, <laughs> guys. Oh, yep, there's aliens there, and there. Oh, I don't know so much. I hope that wasn't. Uh, probably not. Wait, where was? Wait, no, that's a Reaper. Who was? Oh, right, this guy was being shot. Okay. Everybody lived, but Stoop got pretty jacked up. That's one way to put it. So did Cans. Because of all the tentacles. Yeah, it's just soldiers. So. Damn it. 
No, I can't say commander is going. Commander, he's my pal. Damn you, internet beams. Commander. No, oh, there's. Let's have a peek. Like, I was just waiting for them behind the door, just like, booga booga. Yeah. Okay, just a navigator. I mean, just, he can still shoot my face off. Yeah, we can just, uh, just shoot him. Uh, one of you might have enough time yet. Let's see. Can you take a snapshot? No, oh, fuck. Uh, this might go bad. This might be a bad. Well, maybe he won't see us. He'll probably see us. Perfect. Okay. Let's keep you. You have a flex here for reactions. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Fighting floaters, it's just phew, whatever. So, yeah, this is probably just normal. That's a leader. I don't need leaders. They're good. You have a. I might as well poke him in the back. You never know. Might come in useful. Save some ammo. You, if you're a navigator, you don't have the. Do you, you mean you have the. He's facing right at me. I probably shouldn't poke him. It's dangerous. Let's get him. Save. Just snap him. Get yeah, with floaters. You don't really need all the shots. Reapers. Yeah, floaters. Eh. Or what a way to go. There's something there. Over here. Oh, I hate dealing basic intro shit in these things. I'm back. I'm back. You missed our first step. Oh. The alien saw the chance and took it while you weren't looking. See if you get a base like this right at the start of the game, you can pretty much go straight to beat game. You just need leader, commander, boom, you're good to go. What's, uh, speed what's the speed run record for this? Yeah. Uh, I don't know the exact time, but it's like much less than my streams. Like, 
I don't know if it's over or under an hour, but it's fairly fast. Uh, no, you can't get Sidonio uh, without the adventure, uh, Avenger, but that, uh, yeah, I guess technically you also need a, nav a navigator to get, well, so what do you need to get the Avenger? I think, uh, I don't think you need any aliens for that, or it might be the same aliens, Let's have a quick look. I think you just need a navigator. Which is so you can also get in the base if you get really lucky, you might get everything. Let's see. Actually no, you just need you don't need any aliens to have the ultimate craft, you just need all the UFO bits. Navigation, power source, helium, and helium. So you need at least a ship with that stuff. Yeah. You'll get there. So yeah, you don't need just the base, but like the base is, is you obviously also want other stuff to have a chance at Sidonia, but the base it's where you get all the alive aliens you need. against the floaters, but then uh... oh hey, we get a hole in the room. Might see anyone else in here? No. Okay, so commander's probably gonna be up here. So let's get prepared. You you have a probe stick, right? Ooh, he had a blaster launch too. That might have been why he didn't shoot back. Even though their floaters, they still have big guns. Scouting the rest of the base if you spot anything suspicious. Found a few more enemies. Then there's one around here. I probably want to go this way. Maybe try this way. Yep. Okay. C1. 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 I don't 
know if you can use the prod vertically. We'll see. Would be funny. how you do it if you want to go straight for alien base commander capture go in the big room check the floor up there there's probably going to be one there if you're lucky he won't beat the crap out of you looks like he's uh, exactly over here him. i'm gonna save just because i want to check if you can poke him from under i don't think you can also that might happen See, this is why we put on our big, big boy suit. Okay, there's more. Jesus. Yeah, we can't poke from under, so this was just... <laughs> you still survived. That's flying armor for you. So this was a waste. So, I'm just gonna reload that, because that was just check if we could poke from under. From down below, and you can't, so let's... How are we gonna... This without getting caught in the face. See, he can. Okay, I guess my luck ran out. But how should I? Like, I don't want to shoot him. So maybe you try probing him. Yeah, the commander's pretty angry. Uh, I don't, don't think I'm gonna have enough time units now because I messed this up. God damn it. You, do you have a. No, you don't. You, I should. Ah, God damn it. I'm just. No, I'm just. I'm just wasting people. So I'm just gonna reload again because now I'm just being dumb. Stick this out in advance. Okay, let's try this. Let's try drawing out their fire burns. There's no real way to sneak upon because they're like everywhere. Even with floaters, it's kind of situation. I guess this is a situation where I should have brought the stun bombs because I think I even fired them upwards through it. Well, now I know. Next time I'll think of that. Usually I don't just. I don't, I'm not sure they work with the highest death of aliens. The floaters probably would have worked. Be it my obsession with the pokey sticks. I mean, they're cheap and there's a lot more of them rather than bringing... I, I think I do have a stun launcher somewhere back here, yeah. Not getting it all the way over there would be a pain, so... Let's just see what I can make do. So I'm not... Even if I... Yeah, I think I'm, I just have to wait a bit because I don't think I'm going to have enough time units. Maybe one of them will come down? Maybe I won't get shot. Yeah, I think I just need to get a bunch of distractions ready. Because I don't have enough time units to get in there. So let's see how this might go horribly. Also, if you get, yeah, you don't have. Manner. Let's check. Probably over there, huh? Yep, that's him. Okay, well, he's not under the lifts anymore, so now you might have a chance. Okay, so 
I'm gonna take care of this alien here in the back. You can clearly get him to lead her. You can get him. Do you, do you have time to stand him? Hopefully. Oh, he's not facing me that way. Hopefully. Can't. Stabby Stabby. Okay, now I got a command and I just need to clear the rest of the way to not mess it up. Any more aliens? Run? Oh, right, there was this one. Let me go find this church. Let's just surround them, I guess. Oh, at least this guy's a light source now. I guess that's one advantage of putting flares on everyone is that they die, they light the way. Good, I guess. Yeah. So let's confirm there are no more aliens up here. Sometimes they fight. And check this is the commander. Yep. Let's see. Where could the last flood just be? There might be someone up here. Let's see. Ten. Two. No, there's at least this one, so this might be the last one. Remember, there's a little here. Oh, Again! Is he really just camping this hallway and somehow always facing the right direction? That is bullshit. I'm just gonna throw a grenade in there. Like that's just cheating. my way. What the fuck? What an asshole. Let's see if we can get him this time. There we go. And there's more. At least we got this asshole. Maybe there's two of them. That might be the problem. Yeah. Cat blows in the dark. Well, not in the dark, but you know what I mean. Absorbing the light. Get 
thing is the jiggers to the last ones have to be around here. Hopefully. They won't shoot me. Yeah, I hear doors, so there's either there's a room in here or there's like here. Uh, she can't be up here right as I would have seen it, I think. There's a place with doors. Right, it's rocket science. You know what I'm here? No. I know there's a door again. There's, there might be more here. I was talking about where sometimes another leader's commander hangs out and that's why, that's why he's not leaving here. Because I think it's different from this one. It also has a similar shape. Or maybe the same, I, I'm not sure exactly. Here, no, I don't think there's any doors here, so unless it's like here, maybe. I don't think there's anything there. It has to be here. They gotta be hiding in that dumb room. Jerks. Hmm. He's in there. I don't remember the, the Thin Man being a gigantic problem, but none of them have missed it this entire mission. Uh, that's definitely how I remember them. They always seem to be just overwatching with a million miles away with an amazing game. They always seem to be their thing. Like, they spawn in, just drop in on the worst spot possible and overwatch you from a million miles away and have amazing aim, especially against VIPs. If you get just like a, a team of them just like in the middle of the field, they're not too bad, but the ones that just bought in over watching you from a mile away are the worst. Ooh. Okay, let's see, where's... Yeah, he's in there. Jesus. Yeah, they... It's confirmed, they definitely love camping these rooms. Oh, no, that means... Sorry, Colin. Colin. I sent you to your doom. I guess you could just get behind the teleporter and just fire through it. Well, last time I tried that, they just shot me from above it, remember? It's, 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 it's rough. Well, it seems yeah. better than just directly engaging it. If only they would leave their little hidey spots, but they're a bit too clever. Could have just gotten the commander and gotten the hell out of here, but not the command. Oh well, here's hoping. Okay. I guess they do drop down sometimes. You better be the last one, jerk. Fuck's sake, if there's more up there, I'm gonna be real mad. Which there might be, because I. Uh, where else could it be? Just gonna keep here for reactions, I guess. Did you get any wounds? So, where else? Maybe here? If I was an asshole, where would I be? No, oh, there's one. <laughs> Speak of the devil. Wow, that shot went right through. I just 
still more. Where are they hiding? There might be more up here. Maybe. I guess to keep an eye out. I don't need your proby bits anymore. Your orb. Keep your eyes peeled. Once you get sloppy, even floaters start fitting your numbers. So here come goes. Oh, okay, he's panicking. Oh, that's not panicking at all. That's someone else that's panicking. This guy. Wait, I just went. I was just here. He's hiding up in the tower. You tell me. See these towers in the alien bases? They love sniping from up there. Literally, you can go right through and not even see them. Out here, you asshole. Yep, always need those players, even in alien bases. Look at those sniping spots. Can I get out of this? I think so. Yeah, we can get me here. That's what I mean. It's god, the aliens are such jerks. Where do they get off? Dior back in your pants. Come here, help me out. Let's get rid of her. Right now, where did he go? He's gonna shoot me, isn't he? What? You go for a coffee break? Where is he? No, I guess he did. I, oh fuck, now I don't have enough time units. Just complete assholes, honestly. Like, these rooms are just a mess for blind sight. Like, you really need to keep all those, uh, hoard all those counters. Not even Halloween anymore. Get it together. Skull after Colin. Colin, yeah. Ben, words tonight's getting late. Normally. Well, I'm pretty sure there's no more aliens here. Let's get out of here and this place. Nothing. Let's see where he goes. Flying suits. How can you see me and I can't see you? That's just cheating. Come on. Fuck out. And there's still more. Is there still someone up there? I guess I'm gonna have to go and find out. He's not panicking anymore. Wait, he's 
right at the start. What the fuck? What the hell have these guys been up to? Yep, there you what the fuck we have. Fuck's sake. This is why sometimes I leave people in spawn because sometimes they just pull this bullshit on you. Circle around you somehow. Let's see if we can get the spirit without him drinking back. Oh, actually, you might be able to get him, maybe. Just an aim shot might do it. <sighs> Christ. You guys, I know you're a bunch of rookies, so you're really letting me down. Okay. Sides and get shot up, hopefully. Or you might get shot up. Oh, you got lucky. So I better get this jerk. On the floater, jeez. Yeah, wow, we lost trees to all your fucking floaters. Just embarrassing. That's what. Now we should be all set with some of you got some XPs. So. Yeah, lost some rookies. At least at this point, we're not losing anyone super important. Probably gonna just need more soldiers now. Yeah. yeah, I don't think I'm gonna use no grenades. Crap, scrut.
get nice in manners. Where that takes us. I don't know where that takes us, but. I have a freak we need to go to Cydonia. Hopefully, I'll get our butts kicked. In the meantime, let's uh, see how this goes. Ooh, supply ship. Uh, mutants now. I need plenty of supplies. But. I'm not even sure that Firestorm is going to be useful for anything at this point. I'm just trying to go side only, but that can't hurt. You never know. our time until we can get the hell out of this crap. Not, not like we can catch these anyway. Before we get the fire stuff. Once we have fire stuff, we can shoot them for fun at points. So that'll be fun. We got the crap craft, so crap it doesn't even get an X. <laughs> so you know it's Maybe bad. it's on the underside. Time to get the ultimate craft. Lining all of this up. Yay, our first firestorm. We can start work on. Oh, well, we don't have the adventure yet, so we'll just uh, bring you guys more armor and things. It's gonna count. And got some more stall gears to name. No, wait, it's all gears. Oh, right, I need to make some plasma, uh, more plasma beams as well. Oh, for now, you'll just have to share.
That's biding, biding our time until the ultimate craft, and we're off. Oh, we still have to research the commander, but then we're off. Space! So, hold on, fucker, is the hangar here still? Amazing. It's been around forever. I have to send you guys on another supply ship just to be on your toes. <laughs> you have a bunch of rookies, so. Crazy fast yeah. though. Yeah, yep, immediately destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> the best. Yeah. Might not even bother with more plasma cannons. <laughs> We're good for now. Yay! Ultimate Crafty Adventure. So ominous. Space for four tanks, 26 soldiers, two weapons, and just a billion of everything. Looks kind of frumpy looking though. I guess it's like a mix between an alien UFO design and like a Star Trek ish front thrusters and stuff. It's like a mix of human and alien. And like the Firestorm and Lightning. Which were like all the aliens, it's like the hybrid, I guess. Take okay, matter, come out here and get probed for science. So, I'll start making Actually, I'm gonna have to. We just time we got new hangers, like so press one of these crap. Probably. Crew pretty even here. I should probably punish, but I probably should get rid of this guy rager. Never know what might happen.
just look it up. I will thank you. Too. Let's go back to the original map files and go through the holes in the adventure. Because I think that was a bug in the map files. So you might be able to revert that if you really want. I make no promises. Uh, yeah, let's just send Interceptor. It should be fine. If I, if I need to send more stuff there, I will. Airship might get a Snake Man. One left Snake Man terror mission for the road. Looks like. So I don't think I can stop that. I mean, I, mean, I can try. I'm gonna try shooting it down just in case. The fire store. Pacific, but Pacific is whole. Don't tell me it's gonna be Hawaii again. What do you guys got against Hawaii? Jeez. Yeah, Firestorm might be super fast, but they don't have a lot of range compared to Spare Range and stuff, so we'll be. One last crystal admission for the road. At least now you all have flying suits, so. That'll put you out of range of Chrysalis. We still have to worry about the Snake Man now, so it's not all right. Yeah. 
I appreciate that Mech Trooper Zero got shot during that mission, but was he's <laughs> he's so much mechanical armor he like wasn't actually wounded. I just yeah, it just got the first player. We can just patch that up. Wow, you're missing every shot. Okay. Yeah, we might just get it. <laughs> That's the worst I've ever seen one of them do, yeah. Yeah, yeah flutter crash, I might just go over there just to give you guys some XP's. I still, I still remember that alien craft that was like one tile in size. It was just like a pod. That yeah. One guy was flying for some reason. Yeah, that's the, I rarely let those land their crash off because usually any shot will immediately destroy them. So. Yeah. Yes, yeah, literally the, the, the one tile craft. Great. Okay, you're still one of the give you a switch. I think we have. No, no, we have enough flying suits for a month. Most of you will be fine. Guy in the back doesn't get flying suit. Yeah, I named someone after you. No, yeah, I did. I zoomed into the med bay. And there I am, like, sitting on the bed, just, like, palling around with somebody. He's like, ah, they sent me here. I'm not even hurt. That's one of the little details I really like about the new XCOM soldiers pounding around the base. It's like, yeah. yeah. Now those wacky aliens. That was a, like, negative armor penetration. The alien was like, say, no! See how you do. I'm at the dust, okay? I just bought those two. Finally, you can go up to the floaters face to face. Ah, where well, you can fly to now. <laughs> I wasn't prepared for how thoroughly the armor really does let you fly. Like, it pretty much just disables gravity for whoever's wearing it. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. No power source, like, no cooldown, nothing. Just fly wherever. You've earned it. <laughs> pretty much. That's one thing about really classic game design. It's not worried about, like, balance or cooldowns or ability or whatever. It's just, you get this point, you earned it. Yeah. So, yeah, we can probably don't need all these kind of rods anymore. Yeah, we're still probably get probably rid of them. Mind probes. You sure? Sure, I have a blaster launch, just don't mess it up. You too, I guess, because okay, you guys can carry the most. You got that? I'm sure. We probably don't need two of them. Sounds kind of risky since you guys rookie size. Okay, I have plasma. Let's not go overboard here. Yeah, this should be fine. Just give more grenades instead. Grenades are safer in general. You can't react react the grenade. Yeah, let's get rid of these smokes. I never used them. I'll just equip them from the craft next time. They probably don't need grenades. But yeah, it'll be fine. Ooh, this is an interesting map. You know, it's like a desert version of the Tear from the Deep uh, crashed plane thing. It's interesting. Okay, let's just wait a turn, see what are we dealing with. Probably not a lot. Floaty dudes. Can't be that bad. Yep, there they are. Not even gonna have Reapers or anything. So. Yeah, how's that feel? Yeah. Get shot like by it. some guy flying higher than you, now what? Oh, 
still all around us, apparently. Wow. Well, they sure showed us their flank behind us, huh? Sneaking okay. up on us, huh? Behind you. Yep. Nothing personnel, kid. Is it open XCOM now? Yep, Sorry? it's been open XCOM for I guess. a while. Oh, oh, I see, I see. Yeah. Been at this for. 12 ish hours, yeah. For, for 14 20. hours, according to OBS. How time flies. Oh, yeah, yeah I forgot about that, X, that bonus hour, yeah. Our clock's just changed. Yeah. Actually, I should. I shouldn't. I should. If I can find... Oh, they're probably at the back, aren't they? Who... Yeah. Who had the blaster launcher? That would be hilarious. Is there a blaster there? Do I dare? Uh, just back up to shit. That would be pretty risky. I probably should have given someone more at the front. Oh, whatever. You guys just come in. Hopefully, you guys don't get shot up. Very silly indeed. This guy hasn't much time yet, so maybe he can get one. Let's just see. Yeah, if I get up here, I forget one. Oh, I'll shot one of you. Let's see. Let's get one of those jerseys. Wow. Or you just awful. You're all just nice, yeah. What's wrong with you? I mean, this is why you guys need practice, but still. What's wrong with you? It's shameful. Well, hopefully these guys don't kick your ass. That'd be a real shame indeed. Okay, we're fine. Well, I'll still manage to damage you a bit. Well, Earned it by being so bad at Fitch games. God damn, dude. I mean, you're a bit one, if not that one, dude. We missed every shot. Yeah, let's get to my health. We'll patch you up later. Weakling. Come. I think they also aim worse when it's vertically, but I think he's at the same level. Should be. Finally. Where's the other guy? Get out of here, you. Flanks it's bang up. So we can finish this off before the boot dies. I think that's the second time he's been pleading to that.
no, 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 might not have enough time. Well, let's shoot up to Sandy, maybe that lines up mission. Christ, you guys. These floaters. Floaters, how do you expect to save the world with these shooting skills? Also, Eve, you are off the moon. It's great. Do an aim shot? No, of course not. Oh my kid. Finally, okay, that was it. It's complete embarrassment. God, how are we gonna make it inside? <laughs> well, we'll have tanks, maybe that'll help. We'll see. <laughs> Got a whole six alien allies out there. It's worth it. Somebody died. Just played a bit. <laughs> Let's get more HP for always bleeding to them. <laughs> as long as you don't die. It's real Final Fantasy 2 energy there. <laughs> no pain, no gain. Yep. Here we go, Saito here. It's the next topic. Let's see what else we have. Yeah, it'll take a while. In the meantime, we'll pick it. Random scouts, I guess. We don't obliterate all of them now. I guess I'm gonna keep going crash night to see if I can farm you guys some levels. Maybe get some of the rookies up front. To have better chances. If you're not all bleeding, I can't do this. Now let's get some of the rookies up here. know if my squad is ready to fight chrysalids. Yeah, it's hard to tell. Chrysalids, the first new XCOM are too bad. You just have to... They did get somehow Dang, worse in XCOM 2, yeah. Yeah, XCOM 2 is rougher. As long as... They're definitely not as bad as in the original XCOM, since they can only... They can't attack in the second one. I remember finding, being very endeared with their new ability to just burrow into the map and then reappear yeah. anywhere they want on the map and attack in the same move. Yeah. It was very mean. It did make them closer to the original, at least, as far as scariness goes, instead of just walking up to you and stopping. But yeah. As long as your dudes are good at shooting from a distance. Shit. Closing in this. Yes. Speaking of which, Monkey the Sniper just dropped the first one. That's a good start. Yeah. That's basically what do you need.
Which I might give this guy the blaster launcher, not the other one in the back. Yeah, that's I mean, I don't really need the blast launchers yet. Now yeah, let's just go. Oh, it's another death map. Try not to get shot up this time too much. Oh, first sir, I probably should skip the first uh, let's, let's get one. Come on. That much, right? Okay, that's giving me a bit more confidence there. No, she got back up. Okay, sure. Now it's hard to hit because he's not floating. Yeah, I definitely think in the original XCOM vertical aim is worse. You don't want. Flying is nice for staying out of range and reach, but I mean, you can get better. Watch it. Oh. Wow. The one person without a flying suit is down. Amazing. <laughs> Someone had to go. It was faded. Wow, this one doesn't have an armor at all. Where did I put the armor? It slipped my mind. Wow, it got beat up pretty bad. Oh, they're still walking inside that matched up UFO. Must be around here at the back. I'm guessing. They can throw a grenade down there. Yep. There it is. Wow, really? Oh, he's not dead, but still, jeez, fly, uh, floaters. Flying suits really are, uh, paying off. Oh, hey, Will Bob's lad. Now he, I know he's a speedrunner. I can come out of the woodwork. He can tell you all about crazy world of speedrunning. Him and, uh, Jack of Hearts, I believe. Like me, which I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm doing the opposite of a speed run right now. <laughs> Take 24 hours to beat XCOM. <laughs> it's fine, we'll get there eventually. Well, where was he? Holy crap, I forgot mech troopers were this awesome. Yeah. I punched a zombie and it flew through a wall and into a car that then exploded. Yep. <laughs> Gotta love him. It's definitely one of the things I miss uh, about XCOM 2. Yeah. You do get mech like I mean, you things do get eventually, the, yeah. but they're not as amazing. Not quite the same, yeah. Yeah. They're not literally, uh, what do you call those sort of anime robot thingies? Mechas, I guess? Mecha level of ridiculous. Yeah, you do get smash up the environment pretty well on the new XCOMs. Pretty explodey as well. Just not 
much with regular shots, but the explosions and punches and stuff are pretty good. They're not apocalypse levels of destruction, but they're pretty good. They're, they generally collapse fairly well. But sometimes you do get floaty bits. Okay, so where was that? Okay. Yep. Hopefully that's the last one. I'd say. Yeah, well, let's be a bit careful and get walk to the UFO slowly instead of just parading around. It might be better. And hopefully, this guy won't bleed to death. Shame these floaters, jeez. Go check on the rookie, I guess. Uh, anyone met kit nearby? Thank you. Yeah. What? Oh, wait, no, it's the dead guy. Where's the alive guy then? Oh, he's over there. Messed this up. Might die. Oh, well. There might still be another alien here in the rubble. It's my hunch. It's hard to, see, you know, look. Okay, I might be able to save this rookie at least. No, it's yet for that. Where was the, the not dead guy that he ended up dying? There was someone that got shot and fell unconscious, but... Uh, is it under you, the guy under you? Like no, that, arrow? that's dead. That's why I'm checking. This guy's dead. This guy's dead. Yeah, maybe he died and I missed the message. Oh, well. Weird. I don't see any more corpses. 
The yellow. Yeah, these are all floaters. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah, it, it has to be one of the guys with the flying suit, so it can only been this one. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm thinking. The weights of a, a flying suit. There must be someone else in here that I can't see because of all the smoke. I'm tempted to just throw a grenade in there, but. Um, let's see. Yeah, let's just crack a grenade. Everything's already wrecked, so... Hiding in there. Fuck him. No? Nah, hell. One in here, maybe? Make a lot of sense, but I'm seeing weirder. Now where this game spawns up, so. Yeah, Sam. Go in there. Make sure. I think they're in here, but I don't know. Boop, 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 boop. Huh? Huh? Oh, it's the one back here. Actually, be someone inside this pyramid. I just can't quite tell. Where is it? Here. Oh no, it's the edge of the map. Yeah. Okay, that's one tell behind spot. Oh, there. there's the <laughs> so head poking out. Hello. Can I catch him right there? <laughs> uh, not this turn. Well, hopefully, you won't shoot anyone yet. Of course, you can. Hands has been assigned a nickname. It is Pox. I'm gonna keep it. Alright, it's not the worst. Come on here. Come on here. That looks like a head. Just poke your head like that. It's cheating. That should be it. Yeah, wow, we lost two soldiers. Yeah, I guess the other one just guy died. More importantly, we lost a flying suit to floaters. That's just shame. Can't let me down. Well, at least some of you are surviving and getting better. So that's something. And that worked out really well. So you don't have yeah, five more subs. You should be fine. Monkey gets in the middle. Should probably put. I have a hunch that uh, nicknames that are just random words together are bots. Yeah. That's my new hunch. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna give this one to. I mean, probably. I'm not even sure who will be used, but I'll probably give someone to. Full of obsolete. There we go. Cytonia or bust. Just have to wait for the craft to be ready. Anytime you guys will buy us stuff. Let's get crap shield. Really. I mean, we're only real need any of this stuff, so I guess it's science. Some aliens or something, funsies. Fusion Mython might be useful. Yeah, yeah, I think that's what I think. Blaster tanks might be useful to have them. Yeah. Yeah, the other terror ship didn't make a terror sign. Maybe this one will. We should see. I think I can shoot it down, but. Just... No, but...
Probably a bad idea. Bad ideas incorporated. Oh, he's a tough one. Yeah, the airships are. I'm just surprised they didn't shoot back. No, that's them. Pretty sure you outrange everything with that. Probably not battleships, but yeah, maybe uh, tear ships and stuff. Because technically they also have plasma beams. Um, yeah. Maybe the gunner was asleep. Yeah. He did too much alien entertainment. <laughs> oh, geez, the uh, materials are starting to show up. Those are fun. Maybe we can get one alive and just from size get the hell out of here. That might be an interesting challenge. Yeah, battle. Yeah, chat saying yeah, battleships can definitely still fight back. They would. Material they're starting to show up. Ooh, supply ship too. I, I probably I, I never go up against materials, but I just captured the one. Leave it to that. Pretty much it's fire stun bomb, grab them, go back home, just get inside. It might be useful for side only. No need to leave many more side only. Bad about shooting on the supply ship. Messing up! Yep. So we might go and try and get a material from here. Might be useful. Although, alien base in South Atlantic, where the hell are they? Setting up a bay that's like near us. Oh, hi, Rajan. You're. Because <laughs> that's what happens when I'm I stream this long. Everyone gets to wake up. That's yep. what I'm up to. I. I think. Uh, I need to check. I think he died at some point. Yeah, I'm pretty Sorry, sure it was a while more specific, ago. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure he died in this stream, please. Yeah. It might have remember, been a uh, in blast. My, my second Dextral Life stream, I remember pretty much nobody being there for Mega Man X3 because it was right around like now, like 6 o'clock in the morning. Hmm. Uh, but it kind of worked out because then everybody was awake for X4, and that was the good one. Ah, uh, you're doing it like me, Rajan. I haven't gone to bed yet. Because <laughs> uh, he's in the same time zone as me, so he's got no excuse. We're just terrible people. That's our excuse. Oh, yeah. Same. Okay, so what do you think our odds are of being able to nab an uh, ethereal alive before getting uh, mind raped? I'm just gonna. If everyone's done the bombs, uh, some launcher, we'll see how it feels. Where's the materials? He bomb it, grab it, get the hell out. That's the plan. Might be, although I, I doubt I'm gonna take all the time it's gonna take to research whole side tree, but just, you know, you never know. Might be. Might make for a fun little challenge. Might as well. Really, let's go. Here we go. It's gonna happen. At least you guys might get a, if if the materials just get me and wipe me, I'm just gonna load. It's gonna tell you right off the bat, not even gonna pretend to give it an honest effort. It's, it's just cheating on both ends. But I figured you might as well get a uh, look at what materials messing with you is like. So. <laughs> I mean, I've seen it. Yeah. Oh yeah. This Tiny. Yeah, this is the. Well, not tiny, it's just looking at the baby shit. Monkey and Cans are our highest ranked guns, they're both sergeants. Thank you. A few of us are behind them as corporals. Yeah, let's see how this goes. 
Yeah, these things are, are heavy. I mean, actually, I'm just gonna give this to the blaster. Actually, I could just blast bomb all the material, but that won't get me anywhere. I don't think. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to the guys who carry a bunch. Let's see how you guys do. I still haven't given armor to this guy. Poor guy. Let's see how this goes. Well, maybe we'll blow them up. We'll see. We can down them before they get us. We'll, we'll see. We'll just see how this goes. This is gonna be a mess. An amazing mess. So, I'm just gonna roll with it. I have lost the two real missions in like just one, two turns. So, let's see if this will be glorious or not. If I can make a run for it, let's see. Where's. In with the desert. Well, oh. there's one. Someone get him, stun him, something quick. You have the. See, you have time. Yeah, do it, do it, get him. You even think about. Ah, oh, Jesus, really? Go. Yeah. Terrible, terrible. Well, it's, uh, I should... I know, I should... The only upside of materials is pretty good. Actually, although he's seen me, so probably already in trouble. Let the trouble begin. Well, uh -oh. we'll see how this goes. Yep. Mm -hmm. It begins. Once they spot you, it, it all starts going downhill. Oh, come on, you can get him. Just, just, just get him, get him, get him. Oh, Jesus. This is the worst. Well, at least you don't have a blaster launcher. You can't kill everyone just yet. Someone's gonna kill everyone. I do have people with blaster launchers, so someone is gonna someone, someone. It's gonna be real fireworks. I could just blaster launcher the ethereal. This revenge thing. God, I wanna try to get this done. Let's see if we can get this going. Yep. How many player. ethereals are we dealing with here? A lot. It's a supply ship, so... You've seen those before with mutons and stuff. Imagine all of those yeah. instead ethereals. That sounds like problems. Yeah. Yeah, it does. That, this was going to be a challenge. If not uh, <laughs> going to even try and win this. Yeah. The fucker ran off. God damn it. I'm going to get you. It's the last thing I do. It's probably going to be the last thing I do. <laughs> Come on. Get over here, you jerk. They don't even bother shooting me. They can just... Okay, they also shoot me. I, I got the bit cocky there. Well. I think the flying is the only thing protecting me at this point. Not even that. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> I didn't even know someone was, was someone holding a grenade. How did they just oh blow up? Fine, you want it like this? We're shooting each other. See who survives last. We're just getting out of here alive. I would just blaster everyone, but I think that one's somebody's dead. So. I guess someone should just throw a grenade. Yep. says to you, maybe. Oh fuck. Your yeah, flying suits are also pretty good against them. Well, you probably did. Ah, uh, two real missions are amazing. I don't even know you're supposed to do this legitimately, besides just having die. I guess. Get yeah, Psy, you must Psy, so it's like a... 
least we don't know where Mash is gonna be a problem. Let me get that up here. Yeah, problems up here. Damn it. Stop looking at you. Command you. Somehow when I'm doing the shooting, it's when the, it's when the flank sits are good. Let's not bother with the materials, even for capturing. I mean, it was quick. <laughs> yeah. Just wanted to stream at least get to see it at least once. Yeah. Yeah, if I want to try to do it legitimately, I would just bring everyone to Flash 200. Or maybe just tanks. Because tanks can get inside and just go. Apu. It's really not worth it. I think at this point we're just gonna speed run to side on you. Stray material. Don't need him, don't need anyone. <laughs> Just have to believe. Yeah, well, look at how fast the firestorm was. It got here faster than a fucking interceptor. Both get him. That was so overkill. So many days left. Eleven days, and then we're out of here. We'll see how this goes. It's probably not gonna go great. You guys are a bunch of chumps, but I believe and lots of things coming. Well, I probably won't say it's coming, just gonna see how far I can take it at least. Like if it's too difficult with this, with this you guys get get getting excited. or maybe I'll just turn on the at least the Psy mod makes me more mad. Side really is the clincher. This is not the material. Oh, this is sectoid, so I might just. Yeah, I might do a mission there for funsies. But it's daytime. I don't need that much fun. That's too much fun. Yeah. But you guys do need to keep uh, training, hopefully. Basically rushing it to side on you if I can finish this tonight. So <coughs> could be worse. We've had a lot of really lucky missions with Chrysalis and also a bunch of really bad missions with Chrysalis, so you know. 50 50, I'd say. Let's see, in seven days we can blast off the side on you and see how what a disaster that is. In the meantime, we're just chilling with them. Small scout crash site. 
Our accuracy up. This is probably fine. Ah, I keep forgetting to fix the armor. Oh, there's the time to the yeah, scouts right there. Any anyone in there? Hello. Oh good, there's one. Please, you got me. Really? Rookies never failed to fail me. That's a hell of a long shot. Right back at you, buddy. Oh, is that another one? No. Okay. Hopefully you don't get shot to death. We go with something. I'm gonna have to make a whole bunch more flying suits. I'm tempted to just blaster one of these. I get this guy. Ah, oh, whatever, let's try it. If I can pull off a blaster bomb. So. No strats. Yeah. Here. 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 I always do like up and then down so it hits the ground and doesn't fly off into some random direction. I'll minimize the chance of flying off. So hopefully you should get it. There we go. See? So I don't know if I cinched him or not, but see that's how you do blaster launchers, you just aim broad and do up down instead of mm -hmm. uh, horizontally so it doesn't like just deviate off the map into some poor sap. Always into the ground. Yeah, that makes sense. Of course, if you're indoors, you can't do that, and then you just have to get lucky. But yeah, it's life. And there's still more sick guys around somehow. So God, look at how satisfying blaster bombs are. Look at this explosion. <laughs> Beautiful. Just look at all that space where stuff used to be. Yep. <laughs> No, oops, I got the guy without armor out. Well, hopefully you don't die. Maybe. I'm counting on you to not die. That's not saying much. Well, somehow this jerk survived. Maybe you can do it. You're captain after you don't need armor to shoot aliens. There you go. More though. Anyone in here? No. Someone hide anyone's hiding in the smoke. Also you're ah, you're one that you probably healed up soon. Take an mission soon. Yeah, there's another one. Not even close, wow. Why do we even have aim shots? They're just to fool us. It's a false sense of security. Okay. That worked, it's still alive though, somehow. You, can you do it? 
I heard he said mean things about your mom. There we go. At least this time we didn't lose anyone to dumbness. Just a bit of dumbness. Hey, fusion missile. I love these trips. This one fires a ball shaped missile, so a ball, powered by antimatter reaction. The ball is stressed out with a gravity wave implosion. Those sure are sure. some pseudoscience buzzwords. Yep. We got the ball with the thing and it's imploded on itself. Yay. We're pretty sure antimatter is something that's cool. Well, let's go look at some alien stuff, I guess. Yeah, but Tia needs to get the. Thanks for the blessed watchers. Let me look at that. Yeah, it should just be fusion ball. Maybe, oh, I might have just unlocked that it hasn't. Yeah, there we go. It hasn't told me yet. So it might make a cluster launcher tank. It might be fun. What do we have? Oh, right, we're building crab. That's gonna take a ball. Armor, armor, my armor, 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 armor
Someone still ended up without armor? Amazing. Because I think they're in the back. So let's just shoot. Oh, it's this back. Yeah, let's just shoot at the floaters. Is it floaters? I think it was. Where is he? soon. We're gonna be screwed. Oh, nice, it works. We got a cold null now. Colonel. 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 My hog. One joke we have now. That's, that's <laughs> all Metal Gear. It's the one thing I do. It's all about hogs. Stats. Oh, I don't think it doesn't attract. 
I'm sure all these tiny numbers will matter in the end. Maybe. Okay. Well, everyone's still happy with us, at least. Everyone but Brazil, that seriously disappeared one day. <laughs> There was two more days. And then, well, then we'll still have to make some flying suit, but. Nice, but not the very small ones. So I'm gonna be one. Oh, hey, drug hunts. I see you here. Again, I think. Uh, yeah, game's probably a bit louder. I'm probably getting quiet as this goes on, so. Turn it down a bit. I mean, also turn down the record. How oh, this goes. Yeah. Time setting. Yeah. We're so close to failing miserably, I can feel it. <laughs> so you get to decide on you. Yeah. Right, pass out. Battleship. I'm gonna try and set up a base. Let's see how the planning is. Let's see what it's up to. I can just follow it around. I don't even have to speed for that, so. Yeah, there's definitely an ethereal alien base somewhere down here. I might have to just take a peek. Let's see. Where are those guys up to? of each type this is game. Yeah, this is the soundtrack mod, it's the UFO Sidonius Fall soundtrack. Get it if you want. Hey! Adventure is done! So we have to make some points, let's get the hell out of here. How are we doing in terms of everything? Like everyone, oh, it's got wrenched in a while anyway, so. Let's wait for to get here. Well, put the tanks in. Put the Marine grenades now, at least. Some armor. Uh, playing on veteran. He's gonna be rushing it to get Sidonia. So we'll see how that goes. It's probably not gonna go great, but at least it's gonna be a fun way to end the stream. So. I'm a collateral cat. <laughs> amazing. Okay, Rain. 
enter back here. Okay, let's get everyone in here. Everyone can. Everyone enter the party bus. I'm going back. Eighteen soldiers, two tanks, white boots, another tank. Gonna bring up the guy right there. I doubt I'm gonna need med kits anymore. But by the way, okay. Lots of grenades, five probes, no, that launch probably not the worst. Nice launchers, all the heavy plasma. There's 18 of the year. I mean, my tactic is basically rush into the core, so. We'll see how far I can make it. I'm not gonna try and kill all the aliens or some crazy thing like that. I don't know if you need flares and titan, let's bring some in case. And this should be good enough. Have some tanks to cover us. Well, if we can get more flying suit gun and maybe some. Last launch tank might be useful. Let me try. Actually, I'm not sure if they're that great. Yeah, I think that might be a bit much. I might just make one just so we can see what they're like. Doesn't take too long. Yeah, if they're still fat, make the fucking flying suits. Somehow. Okay. No. Almost there. Place your bets now on how bad this is gonna go. I keep shooting down these tricks. Yep, that's me. I'm the guy. I'm the dude. That made the open X comms. Well, started open X comms at least. Lots more people helped. When I found the thing, and here I am now, being terrible at playing it. Now, let's see if I can finish it. At least very competently into everyone's amusement. Wondering why I'm just skipping pretty much everything at this point, and that's why we're just biding our time till we can do that. We're all prepped up for Sidonia. Two tanks, 18 soldiers, should be good. Maybe one good just in case. As we've seen, they can still take a beating, worst case. So my idea is just stage one, find the exit, and just rush over there. See how far I can make it. Maybe we'll get lucky and with the map generation we can rush to the center in stage 2. We'll see. Crash Knight's not a lot of gore compared to when we actually went on missions. It's fine, soon it'll all be over. <laughs> well, thank you. Glad Open XCOM helped get you into your original XCOM, that was part of the goal. 
mean, when I started this, there was no new XCOM, so it was more for for the old fan. But now we have new fans of XCOM as well, so now it's for them as well. Kind of went full circle in a way. I can't paint that should be... Let's see how many... Probably enough. I don't know if I'm gonna wait for every single flying suit. No, I just need three more. Should be fine. Also, we might get a look at that other tank. I should at least give a look at the new game, because they're still interesting in their own way. If you, then, if you just end up coming back to this, where to look. Much, but it's there. Trust me. There is cat here. Just have to believe in it. And cloudy out. Two armor, let's say. Oh, this guy also did more stuff. Might as well bring him. Deadwood's gonna stay, hang back, he just can't leave the hospital. My only regret is that I don't really recognize any of the names that we're gonna be going in here. Yeah. Yeah, half of we these are right. probably bot names, but in other open X commuters <laughs> or other communities. I mean, let me see. I tell them we're messing here right now. My only guy as well from Mexico. Dipwoods from another Discord I'm in. The game Discord. Shins, another uh, something awful Discord I'm in. A bunch of these are, yeah. Which of these I don't know either. Oh well. You did your duty by dying several million times. <laughs> Alright, I wanted to give this guy a blank suit. Look on the bright side, you got to take a lot of, of people you knew to Cydonia and it wasn't a complete disaster, so... Now it's my turn to totally mess up these, these guys. So my head back. back. Okay. Here we go! I think I saved it wrong. No. Oh, it doesn't matter. Don't push the button! Ah. Here we go. I don't even remember what the remix Cydonia music is like now. I can, I can hear it. I know it was an unrealistic thing to hope for, but I hope for a little bit more, uh, you know, circumstance about flying to Mars. Instead, you, you just gotta go, you get a text box that says, you're on Mars now. Yeah. 
the Tear from the Deep is the one with all the cutscenes. Uh, they couldn't fit them, I guess, for the first one. Fair Just enough. get the first one and that's it. Tear from Deep has a lot more dramatic cutscene stuff. Actually, no, there is the. If you want dramatic cutscenes, there is the PlayStation version of this. That one also had room to fit in cutscenes oh, for all yeah, these bits. I think I remember those. Yeah. That one has you going whoosh to Mars and boom to Mars and so forth. And lots of horrible dying. I think there is a mod to put PlayStation cutscenes in Open XCOM. So I guess I should have remembered to put that on there. Oh well. A lot of time. So if you want those, there are mods as usual. Yeah, it's gonna take you a while to finish all the original XCOM games, I think. Compared to how long the new ones take, Air from the Deep is rough. About the same time, it's just harder. Apocalypse is a bit of a slog. I don't know if I'm ever gonna do the whole thing on streams, because I don't think it's... I can tolerate it, I just don't think it's that exciting on stream. Until you get to the late game where all the cool shit's blowing up and buildings falling apart. So I've only seen good. tiny bits of it, but I like all yeah. the little graphical effects in it, the bubble trails from the weapons and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah, it's got a lot of good, but it's also got a lot of just uh boring clunk. I can still tolerate it more than mother. most. If, let's see, who do we got? We have some I just <laughs> okay. I got like a Windows notification. No, it's a Chrome notification that somebody subscribed to my YouTube channel. So I don't wow. know if that person is here, but if so, thank you. Yeah, you know, it's. I don't know what the odds are. Someone finding your it's YouTube. It's possible. From here. I did plug myself earlier. I mean, it was a long time ago, but still. Yeah, no. If it was your Twitch, yeah, but your. Oh, there you are. Hey, thanks. Yeah. Huh. That's, I. I... Do you have a link to your YouTube on your Twitch? Yeah, I was going to say, I do have a button on my Twitch okay. page that points to oh, my there you YouTube. Go. So, yeah. yeah, I do give Kaz and Zero your, your views as well. They stream a lot more regular than me, and they have been through all of this stream putting up with me, <laughs> so you got to give them props for that. Yeah. Hola. Oh, speaking hey. of, hey, Warboy, the other uh, Open XCOM developer. It has schedules as weird as mine. You just yes, in time to see us go to Cydonia and probably fail visibly. Freaking hey, X Cup. Yeah. I just had my sniper whiff a 98% shot and then the assault made a 33% shot, so you know, whatever. <laughs> Numbers, what they mean. Now that I think about it, I, should, I probably should have put Warplay in here, but. Ah, uh, well. Math is fake. Don't worry about it. Who needs Next it? Master is. What has Matt ever done for us? I think, uh, let me tell you. Okay, I probably want two guys with the blast for the launchers this time, because we're just gonna go a wrecking shit, no survivors. Rush for the exit, I think. That's gonna be my strategy. Get the tanks out first, take scout out, to find where the end point is, rush as many people as we can there. Try to hopefully keep them from immediately dying, and then we'll see how we go on the second point. <laughs> see? K Price missed your deep bassy voice, someone missed it. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I think he was here last year as well. I've been here the last couple of years at least yeah. a little bit, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's been mostly the same people every year, because they're probably the ones that follow the thing and then. A bunch of news and olds come and go. But it still amazes me to this day that people still show up every year somehow. Even though I make no fanfare about it, just one day I go, whoop, hey, here's the open XCOM stream. I guess. Just post on some discords. I guess that's the trick to eventually get a regular audience and just hang around as, as many communities as you can. And eventually they'll go, oh, I know that guy, I should go look. <laughs> Once go. in a while, I do get that. Yeah, I think it's a lot harder to get to audience just being just uh, how do you call it? organically from Twitch and stuff because those sites are just full of stuff. I don't know how someone would randomly run into me from there. One of the oh, things yeah. about me is I I barely self promote at all. Yeah. Yeah. Same. 
you just have to spend 10, 20 years like I have on this. <laughs> Eventually you'll get there. Yeah, I mean, so I just need to... to make my own open XCOM and then people will watch me on Twitch. Clearly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, you don't have to go out of your way to promote. I think just being in a lot of places is you're then trying to yeah. promote or get the, the advertising out on Twitches or whatever. Just you hang around enough discords, eventually you will have a bunch of people. Also, my cat is here. She's okay. She's sleepy. You can barely tell, but she's there. You can see the mirrors here, maybe. In any case, if you do want to hear more of me for whatever reason, I do stream four nights a week, so... Yeah, just subscribe to Twi uh, ZR's Twitch if you want. Something that approximately 12 a hours of ZR a week, which I think is entirely too much ZR, but I mean... It, it yeah, he's actually good at games. And he also has a cat, so you know, we, let's win-win. That's true. What more do you want? You can also carry some extra blasters. Yeah, I'm usually just doing like jrpgs and dumb stuff i should do just like Indies. variety DOS streams like once a week or something just to especially now i was full-time employee just get to you know give me an excuse to change things up but uh i i, I forgot if you guys have any free days in your schedules i'm not sure saturday not well sure. saturdays are jackbox night forget yeah, the games. sometimes say, not really we have the week uh yeah, Pretty sometimes, full. well, sometimes you don't do stuff on Mondays, but I think that depends on circumstance. We'll see, I might just do my own thing. And streams but... every other Monday, because the other alternating Mondays are our D&D days. Yeah. Maybe I should just do something like this. I mean, I thought of just doing my own thing and overlap with you guys with that, but I, I don't think it would be the same without your reactions to the crazy well. shenanigans I get up to here. Because I'm used to these shenanigans, but you guys aren't. It wouldn't be the same. <laughs> anyway, let me just get this guy. I think everyone should be more than ready. Yeah. Like, none of this is going to protect you from the psy rape, so... I'm just going to rush it. As much as possible, I guess. Might as well not leave any item behind, because we're not coming back for them. No, let's use some more grenades. Never know. Uh, psh, psh, sure, carry up the extra heavy plasma. You never know. I mean, you have the room, might as well. Okay. Here we go. Welcome to Mars. Fuck the ass. <laughs> Basically, our first priority it's just a bunch of pyramids in the desert. First priority is finding where the goddamn. This is a two stage mission, so you have to find the exit point. So I'm gonna try to rush that. This is legitimately kind of... cool, though, for because for as many years as I've seen you do these XCOM streams, I don't think I've seen you come even close to actually like reaching the ending here. Yeah, this is cool. I've obviously ha have done that on my own, but just on yeah. stream, well, yeah, yeah, completely because I play a lot more carelessly and Iron Manish mm -hmm. on stream. Well, when I play by myself, I just take forever. So good enough. That's why I know the, the the plan I have. Ooh, Cyberdisc already. The, the plan I have here to the coward's plan, which is just to rush this and do as little as possible. And if I can pull that off, it's only going to be pretty impressive. Not going to worry too much about... Oh, oh, wow, we got really lucky. The exit point is right here, right? Like the Sun Ranger, so let's just keep some cover, rush all you guys here, and we'll skip right to the second stage. This is what I was hoping for, some map generation luck. <laughs> Just get out of the way. Things will hopefully cover you, not immediately die. So far, so good. It's just an hybrid disc will be fine. If the cyber disc explodes, it might give you some cover, so. I'll just unblock the ramp a bit. Like, I'm not even gonna bother skipping the first turn, because that might be too much time for the end. It's fair. Okay. The cyber disk is still alive. Man, that's a really lucky map gen. Yeah. So I'm just gonna rush everyone over here. Hope for the best. Like I said, this 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 is the last mission. Like it's not even worth engaging, trying to kill anything. Let's just go, go, go. It's easier to rush and tear from the deep because they have more outside space to enter. Here, it's just this tiny little door. It's going to be a bit bumpy getting all these people in here. This is as many as possible before the size starts happening. 
so just go 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 yeah. we'll see if the second map generation is also lucky or not we can only hope yeah top looking at the i know the cyber disc is fascinating uh, maybe you could try shooting it too I trust you guys a lot less than the tanks, honestly. Okay, there we go. That'll give us some cover. Maybe. Distraction. Just go, 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 go. You're all in flying suits. At least I think grenades shouldn't be... Well, I have 3D explosions, but uh, aliens, I don't think. They're gonna try and grenade you in the air. I'm not sure. We shall see what happens. Either way, we have tanks to cover you. As many meat shields as possible. There's Looking at that landing trap and I'm remembering trying to Tetris my troops into there so we could withdraw from the mission. Oh, yeah. I think it was actually you who I had to leave behind. <laughs> yep. It's fine, I probably deserved it. <laughs> turn how badly is this gonna go we shall see ruthless in this as you can see well that's shit now no and of course there's aliens in the exit waiting for us no and there's already psych going see this is why i don't even bother to attempt to do this properly because whoever survives is earned it But yeah, I don't think I'm, we're even gonna get the tank from the last stage because that door doesn't fit him. Or they, I forget if they can go from above. We'll see. Where they, everyone, is everyone gonna end up killing each other? Get <laughs> it there. It's right there, guys. Come on. Christ. Look at this. <laughs> Man. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, this is why I hate Psy. If this ends up being a wipe right here, I just disable it. This is just, again, like I said, this is just cheating. Aliens cheat a lot more than me. I'll be We're already down to, coming. like, what, six people, maybe? I hope 16. And yeah, the tanks won't make it, so they might as well just tank back and take as much damage as they can. They just keep spot, uh, spotting our own side dudes. Yeah, look at these guys. Look at those guys. Fuck, I'm just gonna fire the blaster bombs. Blow up whatever you can that's out there. You'll hit something. See? Never fail. Not gonna do it here though, because here is a bit more risky. But. Well, I think the other person with the blaster launcher died horribly, so. Someone get it. Oh, this. Yeah, I guess. Someone got this guy? Or did he die? Yeah, I guess I'm blessed there. Yeah, one of the guys who went berserk got him. Okay, yeah. Jesus, look, they're even camping in here. Get out of here. At least they're only sectoids. The second phase is worse, but. That's still pretty mean. Get out of there. And this guy's on stuff. I'm so back, sure. boy. That's a lot of stiffs. Yep. Yeah. Like I said, every time you blink for a second, everyone dies. Get to stop doing that. Clearly, it's all your fault. Yeah, this guy's only trolled. This one's panicked. This one's so fine. Oh, no, 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 this guy's blocking the entrance gate. Just 
sometimes if I had keep kept my gun rods, I just stun them and throw them at the exit. Sometimes that's faster. <laughs> just fling them in there. Okay, one of you, you will bobsled. I believe you're a speedrunner, you know things. You can take the hell out of the sacrifice, maybe. There we go. It's gonna be pretty much non stop tying now. Uh, spotted us, so pretty much all we can do is just rush it. And bottom goes here. Might bleed before you make it to the Pedonia. We will see. I might have I might just shoot the guys that are under alien control because they're liability at this point. I don't think they're gonna recover. The tanks will block them, I guess. This guy. Better for the tank to go than to anyone else. You guys are panicked, you guys are just, Jesus. We came with a full craft and I'm probably gonna get like, what, four people in the second stage? This is just a mess. This might not be at all. Yeah. Well, it comes that I'll just reload, disable side trying it. Yeah, this is just mean. Pretty much your only defense against side bullshit is bringing your own side bullshit, so. Just... <laughs> I got here because I probably want to save this map generation. Not well. I was just doing it. Yeah, that park right in front of it. Yeah. And still just got annihilated by side attacks. Yeah, I don't remember how you made it further. To I don't either. <laughs> I know it took me a little bit of doing to find a place. I wasn't anywhere near as close to it, but somehow or another I got most of my guys through. This is just brutal. Also, hi. Hey, K Price. Hello. I just thought I would take front of, rather than just be in Twitch chat, I get like courtside seats to the, the massacre. Yep. We might get a whole one person in here because everyone is panicking. It's just gonna be Brimcon, which at least I think is a real person. I think everyone else. <laughs> One whole person, how am I gonna do this? The minute they get mind control, it's over. This is just complete annihilation. God damn, XCOM, why would you do this? Can I at least get one? This guy, can he get from. No, this is, has to stop. Oh, god damn. I just shoot this guy out of the way. I'm dead desperate. Get out of here. There. I need someone to make it. Uh, I might just, yeah, I might just abort everyone else. It's just fucked. We'll see how the yeah, two units of uh, a whole craft in one turn. Two turns, I think. <laughs> My God, this is good. I'm going home. This is stupid. Yeah. Yes, yeah, dual wield heavy plasma. I'm sure that will do something. Actually, this guy could have the grenade here. The surface of Mars looking like the Somme. <laughs> well, let's see how this map shake out. Uh, out. Oh, so far so normal. If these guys are Bill Riser and Lance Bean, you're good to go. <laughs> Otherwise, shit. See, I forget what the exit looks like. I think it's like a big... 
alien or anything. Looks like a big alien-y, uh, squarey alien-y thing. I guess I'll see when I get close to it. Probably want to keep these guys out of sight, at least for turn one. This stage, though. Because now we have actual cover. Or an attempted cover. Yeah. Nope. Oh, <laughs> so much for brave lad. <laughs> Nothing's even <laughs> happened yet, man. <laughs> I can't take it. Why'd you bring me here? He came inside and he was just like, wait a minute. I'm on Mars! Ah! Why is he these things are taking what a billion shots? That? God damn it, I'm already getting inside yet. Yeah, it's just mean. How? Because an how? alien saw me. That's how it works. The minute you get spotted, you're. No, now he's under a drill whelp. Yep. The minute something spots you, you're just uh, fucked. This game's just mean. Probably gonna... Yep. Probably just gonna have to reload this without Psy. It's just too much. It's just too much, too much, man. Oh, and. Yeah, sure. Fine, I'm just gonna. Mm -hmm. Run. Not even gonna. Come on, let's go. Somewhere. Yeah. You, you know, you know, Zor, you said you said that, that this would be a cinch if this was Bill like Bill Riser and Lance Bean. I'm gonna <laughs> say these are more like the robots from Probotector. <laughs> <laughs> I get that. Who do you think's gonna die first? This guy or this guy? Uh, I guess we'll see. Or neither of them, because they're just gonna be built in the control. Yep, that's it. Game over. I don't remember if you've seen the game over screen, but now you get to see it. Oh, how how awful. Rather than kill them themselves, they're gonna have both of them turn against each other. <laughs> yep. That's how it went. The aliens, the aliens attempt, attempt, to, attempt extermin to exterminate all right. humanity. And do. The end. I thought you were gonna read the whole thing with your uh See, with your I, right I, voice. I've just, oh, I just I noticed the game's a bit cut off. I should probably yeah. fix that. Um you know what, I'm gonna blame you for this super. One time when I pl when I played this, um I was just starting the game and it immediately gave me a base defense mission. And I got wiped. So yeah. You can blame him for that, I'll take it. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm blaming you, sir. You're the open XCOM guy. Yep, I did it. It's me. Uh, Arden Jesus just hates you. No, it was me. I, I personally I personally embedded myself in the code, and every time Pay Price shows up, I just go in there and just like, fuck yeah. shit. And you know what? I wondered what that snippet was all about. <laughs> I was just gonna say, you know what? Since he's here too, I blame you as well, Warboy. Yeah, I'll, I'll trouble that. God, look at these. These are the most boring mutants I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, he's got two arms. Uh, aliens are terrible. Man, think of all the things you could do for Oh, no, there's man, a think of man. the Yeah, think of the positive side. Hell, like four, having four arms would be cool. Well, at least I get to look at my stats. Also, for those joining in, this is I'm continuing to save from last year. Otherwise, I wouldn't have made it this far. We still ended with an average accuracy of 27%. You guys are terrible. <laughs> the mutants did beat the sectoids in the end, though. As far as the deadliest alien go. Because it went on a lot of uh, mutant missions in the end. Someone... Well, no, not someone. That's total. You guys stayed in the hospital for a total 200 and... Wait, how's that possible? It's... Like, I guess we had someone in the hospital the whole game, basically, because we had 274 sick, uh, sick days. I think it accrues each individual person as Oh, day. yeah, that, even still, that's still a lot. But you have two people in a hospital for a day, that is two days added. Yeah, but, like, we only made it up to, we only made it to, like, July, so that's at least, what, four people in the hospital all time? Which... A lot of people getting shot. Yeah. yeah. Guys are just the worst. Why did I even bring you to Sidonia? What was I thinking? How many times did you like fully refill the damn the? Uh, we the, recruited eighty-seven uh, soldiers action? total. Lost like seventy-six, not counting this mess. So managed to kill two hundred aliens though. 
and again ignoring any wipes but yeah <laughs> okay i'm not i'm not anything like this i think i'm just gonna have to disable psi it's mean but it's just too much i don't have psi ready people so where's the okay psionic line of fire at least just just I, you gotta give me that otherwise i'm not making it up i, I need to psi train people to beat this quote unquote legitimately and i'm not doing that okay, so let's see where this save was yeah there we go i saved Hang here on. so now i should you, have a chance you the you the open xcom guy not beating this game legitimately what what example are you setting here the coward's example you gotta learn Everyone else in this community is like a super pro, try hard speedrunner. They don't show you the real XCOM, they just show you how to beat it. The good way I'm gonna show you the bad like way. Yep, I bet nobody else has shown you how to beat this the coward's way now, it's up to me. <laughs> to me. But yeah, you'll see just how much of a difference not having Psy will make. Like, I'm still gonna have to like beat up all those aliens either way, so it's still gonna be rough but I, yeah. I get that but still just like wow I'm I'm so disappointed I thought yeah. you were better than this see that's where you were wrong you <laughs> thought I was better than this <laughs> but yeah no it's just if I wanted to beat this legitimately I need uh, a bunch more streams and I'm not gonna do that tonight or at least Same plan as before. Plan's still solid. Get the tanks out. Shoot the dudes. At least now I don't have to rush in as much. I'm actually trying to clear up. Because uh, I'm still gonna get side even because I just turned on the line of sight mod, so the any sectoids here that have psi abilities, they can still psi me. It's just not every single thing in the map can psi me, so we'll see the difference it makes. Like, it's still gonna be rough, but not as rough. I just wanna skip, like, the obviously the first stage is kind of the worst, but you can start on this whole open landscape, just aliens coming out from the dark, shooting you everywhere. The second stage is more regular base layout, so it's more manageable. You can take your time. So I just wanna rush to that point. So, let's see how we make it this time. Yeah, I might just roll the flare out. See what's lurking there. Yep. Amazing throw there. Oh, nice. The real champ. A whole four tiles in front of you. Maybe it hit the tank. Well, I just rush you guys. Hopefully this time you won't all murder each other immediately. Just a little, just a little bit. Also, never forget, we have blaster launchers now. Let's just abuse the hell out of it. We know there's aliens there. That's why we brought way too many blaster launchers. What's the point of bringing a blaster launcher if we don't abuse the hell out of it? So, there you go here. Up here. Down here. Should be enough. Wow, didn't hit a single thing. Where the hell are they? I saw shots. I know you were out there. Jerks. You just got the same map, doesn't mean the aliens are gonna do the same thing, I guess, but still. Hate wasting a good overkill. When I blast off the map, I want them to scream, damn it. Them, but the map's not really designed for it, so they're just gonna screw you over. So, right. again, tanks yeah, not I'm great for these final it. missions. There's armor, pretty much. But there's a 
shame because you know, thanks can thank, yeah, thanks can thank these last missions a lot better. I remember trying to do the last terror from deep mission just with the uh, uh, place uh, what are the tanks called? The placers, and it went a lot better. There from the deep though, the last mission it's three stages, and that's just. Ooh, yeah. The that game. Yeah, that Ooh. One. yeah. yeah I, th I think you start running out of ammo before you start running out of dudes. If you're not like scavenging, it's just it just never ends. Yeah, not uncommon to salvage weapons from fallen aliens. Okay, let's see the difference with just just line of sight psi. Let's see, so any issues. So I can still get fucked by aliens like that. So it's still not gonna be easy peasy, but... How the fuck did that blaster launch and not hit anyone? Yeah, I don't think any of the sides out here are the ones with Psy, so yeah, you can see the world of difference makes very few aliens can actually Psy you with your new line of sight, so it basically nerfs them, but it's, it was either this or... They can still beat me up pretty good, so I think fair is fair. They cheat, I cheat. They would have to get my legit cheats to their level to do this legit, basically. I just, I'm gonna fire another blaster on him. Actually, I'm just gonna take the tank, see what's going on over here. Oh, it's another sniper? I don't think he was there before. That's interesting. Disc against disc, I guess. Okay, you guys keep them entertained while we take care of these. And try not get stuck in the door, please. It's always a pain. And that's a disc. Yeah, huh, this time those sectoids in here, so I guess they do move around a lot. Or they all left, I guess. Let's get many people to begin in here. Let's get in. Get in. last time. I guess they didn't have to. Yeah, they had your operatives to kill everyone for them. <laughs> yeah. Uh, see anyone else can... Okay, so just get in the way of the cyber discs. Distract them. Thank distractions. There's always someone that runs out of time units at the doors, ways. It always happens somehow. Maybe you guys can have fun shooting at Cyberdisc. One last time. Not, not that Cyberdisc. The one on their side. Jerks. I mean, trust you guys to pick one. one last shot for the team. There we go. Got a sectite too, I think. Yeah. Okay, now we should look at it. Yes. We just started and it's already, already ruined Mars. I'm gonna be so mad at us. Gonna look through their super telescopes and be like, what the fuck?
So yeah, at least Zero can say you got this on me. He beat this first try. But all the thingies enable and somehow then immediately get wiped. This is true, and yet I attribute this purely to dumb luck. Yeah, I mean, it's always dumb luck. You did get dumb luck on the second stage, but it still counts. <laughs> you made it that far, so I, I think it's so. <laughs> XCOM is a game about dumb luck. If the dumb luck worked yeah. in my favor, I'm not mad about it. <laughs> okay, so next turn, should probably be able to get everyone in. <laughs> Only <laughs> corpses. Left behind. No, still someone there. You know, Rhino is just plain not destined to make it. Yeah. Squeeze yourselves in there. Alien tech is strange and small. I have to make room. Yeah, don't worry about it. It'll be fine. See anyone? Everyone? I think I got everyone. Just gonna like the tanks have some fun. Before we go. Let's see what's going on here in these pyramids. Get as many as we can while we're here. Yeah, I don't think there's any way for the tanks to get here. How many? Already down 14. That's started with. Actually, we brought two tanks. Started with 18. Yeah. Four died already, so. Not terrible. Yeah. Basically, a Sky Ranger reward, so we'll see how this goes. Blasters go around. Let's see how the map shook out this time. Godspeed. Wow, you're. Where's the. You're pretty. Let's see, yeah, you're pretty far apart this time. Let's see. Who are we working with? Shh. Probably not bring out the one blaster launcher. Yeah, blaster launcher should stay in the entrance. For OSHA compliance reasons. Well, so far, it's so normal. Don't see any obvious. It's a room. I think the yeah, the alien room is a room kind of like these ones that just have like a door and the lift in the middle. So I think that's right. Bigger than the. The usual ones you find like this. So we'll just have to see. This one might be too small. We'll see. Usually the alien will be like somewhere around here. I think, yeah, Zero, if you watch the streams, basically Zero got lucky because an explosion from underneath blew the brain up and that ended the game. Yep. Right. So that was pretty great. From like a panicking commander or something or another. Yeah. Not even something I did. They just blew themselves up. And I'm just like, you know what? It counts. Yeah. It totally counts. Yeah, it's the way I would have wanted the aliens to die by their own hands, peeing themselves. So if we're lucky, like, this might be the bit. I think mean, that's too much luck. If not, we'll have to go around. Anyways, this turn was so let's just uh, get some guys on guard duty and see what shows up. That. Yeah. 
Oh. Okay, actually Brood. go back up. Yeah. You know, you hang there. Yeah, us fixing the acid attacks made them a lot more dangerous because usually they had trouble. Yeah. Because of the arc of the shots in the original XCOM, usually they couldn't fire much indoors. But we made it better. Anything that made a player's life worse, we made it. I guess that's the general idea. Why did we do such a thing, Warbot? What's wrong with us? Because we hate the player's soldiers and we want them to die. Ah, yes, I forgot. Terrible. Precious, oh, terrible precious people. XCOM tears. They feed us. Huh. Let's put this. No, no, I think there's a few small feed the room, but they'll all have a look. You're both terrible. Unbelievable. Would you have us any other way? Yep. You knew anyone that would remake XCOM would have to be a terrible, terrible people. That's true. And especially considering one of the two one of the two criminals is uh somebody already taken over by the Dark Hado, it makes sense. Plus stage is interesting because as, as you saw before, you just get all kinds of mixed aliens in here. It's not like even a specific race or something. First stage is mostly sectoids. The second stage is just anything goes. It's really weird getting lumpied in the end game. Yeah, let's see if. Yeah, I don't. I don't think it's this way. I think the big room is actually bigger, so we'll see. Yeah, the, the door to it is further. Yeah, because it's like, this is like one block and the other one's like a 4x4. Four four. It might be here. No, yeah. it also ends here. Yeah, it's like a 2x2 two two for two blocks. I think that's the difference. That's how you can spot it. Those kind of patterns. It's all in the tiles, man. I don't know how we'll bobsled, but you ended up front of the line, so you come out here. Maybe you'll win this for all of us. I mean, if anyone can finish it quickly. Yeah, exactly. That would be very... karmic. No, off to a great start. I didn't think the Chrysalis could run all the way over here, but... Well, this is why we brought blaster launchers. I, actually, I think it's... Oh, no, what? Nobody in the center has a blaster launch? Come on, guys. Well, time to... Whose fault, whose fault is that, that they don't have blaster launchers? Hmm? Hmm? Santa? I mean, I could technically blast all the way from here to there, but uh, it would be tricky to pull off. I'm just gonna try and fix this the old fashioned way. Administer repeated shootings until the problem stops. Goddamn, like zombies right on the exit which has the fewest people. It's not ideal. Let's maybe just keep blowing them up. Wow, that sucked. Okay, that Oof. was even a worse idea. Let's just bring out people who know what they're doing. Shoot. I should have stuck with my original plan, which was just shoot, shoot, and more shoot. The shooting. That's what I call it. Oh, at least we think we softened up a bit. Uh, will Bob Sled, I might have to take back what I said. I think he might be the first to kill. Well, second. <laughs> I regret nothing. So I'm gonna give it a attempt to take down this zombie. It's gonna be rough. Okay. You might make it if you don't bleed all your guts out next turn. 
mean, did I still bring medkits? I think I did. Again. Wait, no? Where did, did, did I really not bring medkits? Oh well. You might or might not live to tell the tale. We'll never know. What a way to go to bleeding his death from your own grenade. Yeah, exactly. It's just, it's just a pleasure. You'll be fine. You have like 12 turns. We can just. You just have to use your speedrun strat, and this will be fine. Might be this room? This looks like an ominous big room. Let's see. Uh, no, this also might just be one block. Let's see, let me have a look at the map so far. It might be something. How big is this? This is one end, and this is the other, so it has to be something here in the middle. Uh, this one's two blocks, so it might be this one. This is, yeah, this is two blocks. This is one thing. Might, yeah, might be this one. Might be here. Dodge. How long is it? Yeah, I think it might be this block. Let's just get over there. Hopefully it's not full of chrysalis. You guys, you guys are still all here. Get them let out. Get out there. Do your duty. For Earth. Yeah, I'm fairly sure it's gonna be here. Usually, I think it's the the thick size that toys or materials are here in this last room. It's almost they spot us. We might be start running into trouble. Doors diagnostic, they're all working, okay. The stereo sound you wear the warp by really adds another dimension to this one wearing wet uh, headphones. Sorry, what? Uh, stereo sound. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes it much more ominous. <laughs> You got the jerk control. Let's see what's going on over here. Yeah, I think this is it. Here we go. how they can growl just the blob of stuff. It's truly a mystery. Nah, don't worry about it. Which I think this might also be... Is this? Yeah, we can bear. Is this bigger? No, this might be smaller. See, one of these is be the one. I'm not sure which one. I, I, this one looks a bit bigger. Oh, it's design. Yeah, it's got two entrances. This one just has one. So, yeah, I think it's gonna be here. Fairly sure.
Here's hoping we can beat it or will Bob pledge it. Becomes a bloody pulp. Oh dear. Thing of bloody pulps. <laughs> chrysalids will always be chrysalids. And they sure knew that when they put so many in the last stage of this. And probably what I would use to defend my secret Mars base. Yeah. Come on, no air mash. Do a sprout. I don't think there's any point in using grenades in this. Or maybe, uh, do I have the blaster? I might just blaster it. Um, I don't feel ashamed for possibly having the same scum this if I mess up the blaster, but might as well give it a shot. This, 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 I don't think I have any, anyone else around here. I might just end up hitting the brain at this rate. If it's around here, I forget if it's on this side or this side. It's on the I west it's... side. Which west? This one? No, uh, north, north being top right. So yeah. west being top left. Yeah, I, yeah, I think yes. Yeah, so I could probably just cheese it and blast her from the bottom, and it might hit it. But eh, let's give it, let's give it an honest shot, so people can see the brain, all four tiles of it. If the, I don't completely mess up this blaster. Well, I blew stuff up. I didn't mess it up, but uh, I also didn't get what I wanted. At least I made a pretty hole, I guess. I think they could do that. There's still another bristle around here. I don't know where he went and some old blaster didn't kill him. That's scary. Yes. Keep your eyes peeled, okay? Keep your Keepers open. This is a bad used room. I don't like it. So we have sort of the shortcut. I don't think this is much of a shortcut to the working hill here. We blew stuff up, that's what's important. Blowing stuff up. Well done. We didn't blow any bars up when we blew stuff up. That's the important thing. <laughs> Accomplished nothing, but explosions are pretty. What do you want from me? Here. No, actually, yeah, I was, yeah, this is the one. I was looking the wrong way. Interested in here, it's this way. So yeah, it's, if it's this way, alien's gonna be around here. So this might be sort of a shark. We'll see what's on this side, I guess. So we actually, yeah, we actually got better luck with the generation this time. It's pretty close to the entrance. I mean, these maps usually aren't too big. Reload another one of those many many blast bombs in case. I have a crystal on lose and that concerns me. Hopefully we can reaction them. Well, they only seem to beat the reaction. Yeah, actually this might not be a shark because I think this is all walled off because there's only the path here. Oh well. Yeah, Chrysalis always seems always seem to beat your reactions. Which sucks. So I wanna get people out here. There you go. Run a bit. We'll see who gets the final shot. Was a chrysalid. The zombie didn't pop out of nowhere. Or they yell. Yeah, it doesn't seem like the blaster did anything around here. Okay, we set things on fire. That's a plus. That's always, that's always fun. Where did, I, did I kill the chrysalid and the blaster? Or was it this one? Maybe, maybe it was this one. I forgot. Just, 
a lot going on. So let's see, anyone here? I don't think they usually hang out in this corridor. Yeah, no. Actually, yeah, it's this corridor. Oh, I might have a little, if I made a hole here to the lift. So yeah, this is how it works. Lift here, a corridor down to the lift here, and then the alien's gonna be here. I could just try to blow it up from under. We'll see how this goes. And up there is also should be a button. Sectoids are material. I think it's materials to thin again. Usually, yeah. Yeah. That might as well show you as much of this as possible without cheesing it. As amazing as it is to blow up an alien brain with a fucking blaster launcher. I should at least try to get that far. all walled off. No shortcuts here. So we have to go all the way around. Yeah, let's bring something back up, just in case. There's no way just one person's gonna get. It's gonna be bad news up there. You can do it with a little slide. Well, speaking of materials, uh, you should probably finish this guy before he starts causing us trouble. Make sure in your miserable condition. You wow, not nice shot. Yeah, you might not be able to because you're just like a bloody pulp. What can I do that won't get me in trouble? One little shot. God damn it. It wasn't enough. Well,. Hopefully you won't get mind controlled and ruin it for everyone. We'll see. That'll be an interesting twist. You might just get blasters with the material. Yeah, I'm used to usually being a lot more it is in these last stages because Terra from the Deep just throws you tons of them at you. This one's a bit more lightweight. Yeah, and you gotta fight your way through every single one to get to the coffin at the end. Yeah, because the map is a freaking maze of madness. It's just a big spiral. Yeah. Well, that's one way to go. And an ethereal killed himself for you. Don't be proud of him. At least you didn't just bleed out to death. You went on the blaze of glory. <laughs> yep. Now speaking of it, yep, here they start coming down. Well, you can probably take one down. Easy does it. There's probably gonna be more. Materials up here, right above me. But oh no, there's more. God, these rooms really are full of them. Where's the other one? Oh, the other one's I think the other left. So I might be able to get them from here. Uh, I should let's see. Uh, actually, I don't think I can. Maybe if I just get out of sight, they won't shoot me back. Let's see. Block the left, he's probably just gonna shoot me. Well, here's hoping he didn't notice his comrade to go out in the place. Plasma.
Okay, that also works. For me. I guess he did see everything and he's just like, oh, no. Let's see. So yeah, you, oh, there's more stuff here. Yeah, you didn't get, I, I don't think you saw this from last time's ears, so here it is. The alien brain, isn't it spooky? It's a whole stretch and switch to frame animation. So that's what it looks like. <laughs> I yeah. literally never even saw it. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of materials here, actually, yeah. So yeah, I think he, yeah, I think he, something blew up in this region. Yep, I was, uh, I was looking down that hallway and something blew it up, yeah. But yeah, this is, compared to everything else in this game, it's such a pathetic animation, I don't know what happened. I don't see the little screen that says no. Yeah, it's gonna be the, you know, eh. what do I have? If yeah, I had... honestly, considering I had eight frames of animation to play with, that two frame is kind of yeah and it's like literally just a stretch not even two different frames it's just... yeah, like that other glob is like the smoothest animated thing in the game yeah you know? yeah <laughs> i guess time to blow it, it up uh, yeah small brain for um oh well, let's go these guys first self basis uh, with um Eight it's really carve out bad for the brain because it's it's four tiles, so we can't like shoot it in one go. So we can we blow it. I up. think it ends if you kill one tile. Really? I guess I'm pretty sure it does. In there from the deep, it does, and that's why I'm used to always having shoot all the tiles. Oh, in that case, I might still have time to take a shot. We'll see. Cause that's what made it challenging to from the deep, it's like these, all these bits you have to explode. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll, I'll, I'll finish you guys off. Just, just <clears throat> hang on there for a second, I'll finish off you guys next time, don't worry about it, okay? Hang in there. Everyone will be killed in due time, don't worry about it. <laughs> oh dear. They're not happy about it. Hey, you're supposed to be panicking. No, dude, you were so close. Damn it, dude. Uh... Wow, oh. yeah, they're coming out of everywhere. That was a good shot. Yeah. Okay, well, let's see if your theory checks out. Go straight for the brain. Let's see. No dig backs. Pew. Looks like you were right. Alright. No, I didn't even notice the cat cam is gone. Oh well. Cat doesn't hear the CDs. Shameful. That music though. Oh yeah. Didn't they? You better believe it. Only made possible by the brave sacrifice of Colonel Duder. Yep. He sacrificed himself for B. The I forget the other guy's name. He hit like five bullets before he went down, so gotta give him credit at least. Yeah. Yeah. If I knew I could have just skipped them straight to the, for the brain, but oh well, it was more dramatic watching all the ethereals rush the panic. Ah, we gotta stop them. They're almost there. <laughs> I don't know if this, this should go forward automatically. It might just take forever. This going. You don't know what you're doing, human. Billions of years ago, blah blah. The aliens ruled every uh, space. <laughs> Join space? us, and you too can have space. Pyramids, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Trust us, they're really cool. You don't know what you're missing out on. And nah. then you just go pew. And they, they go, no. Oh. Uh, so I can't believe they actually tried to model that armor suit thing. That butt, there. 
That's what I was going to say. That plot. You gotta, so I had not noticed the butt. You gotta have abs of steel when you're going at oh, the aliens. God. It's like rotated at like a Rob Liefeldian angle so it really catches the shadows from the explosion too. Also his feet just look like fucking suction pods. It's amazing. <laughs> all of it. Like, compa like you have all this amazing pixel art and you just have that CGI just fuck it. We can't even try to render that oh, look. armor. The aliens... The aliens are gone, so now we can claim Mars for ourselves. Yay, space colonialism. <laughs> we did it. We did yep. it. We own space now. Yep, this will never go. Bite us back. Never, never. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. And that's it for XCOM. So that's still basically the same as last time, only now it says victory. We still say good evening. Yay. <laughs> if you think about it. This is a run that took two years to complete. So clearly, officially, the longest XCOM run. You ever. have the best time. You have the biggest number. You, you <laughs> yeah. the best speed run. Yep. <laughs> yeah. See, speed runs are like the opposite of golf. It's fine. Amazing. Well, anything to cap this off? I'm gonna pull up the. The PlayStation videos for you guys, so you can have a little bit of the drama to go. Yeah. I could play more games for the rest of our life. I think we've had uh, 16 hours, eh, close enough. Oh, I beat XCOM, is, is good enough. I think it's worth doing more XCOMs or other things to fill out the rest of the fight four hours. So, just load up some. Videos and then call it, yeah, <laughs> yeah, before we all die of something or other. So, fuck your. I think we shouldn't couldn't package those videos. Yeah, I think there is a mod that adds them, but yeah, I don't think we can make it built in. Yeah, there's yeah. a mod. It's just yeah, shame we can't do it ourselves. Yeah, like everything, there is a mod. That we can go for it. Why can't I find the... Uh... We got removed from YouTube? Where are they? Ah, here we go. You're going to have to watch this on Twitch because I, I can't point. I mean, I can, but I'm not going to bother just pointing the score just to a browser window for a second. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, I might. So I don't know if the score is going to like it, though. Let me see. Uh, this might work, hopefully. If I mess it up. Just point. Yes, it does as well. Yeah, uh, I think that should be a thing. And by these actual cutscenes they made for the PlayStation version of Original XCOM. Can't get over that effect. <laughs> Just a yellow MS Paint circle. At least you got an MS Paint circle with wrinkles.
and the muton and the red pajamas are like, hey man, you cut that out. I say. Oh wow. It just keeps getting better. Yeah, it's all the mission briefings. Mostly reusing assets, but you know, they did their best. Yeah. Even for a port. Shiny. <laughs> I remember this one now. The blank stare on that sectoid's face is fantastic. <laughs> Like, it just shifts from like a 3D model to a sprite to a 3D model again. Still not quite over that they really did the face on the on Mars thing. Time to fly back to my. We won. Time to fly back to my Earth JPEG. <laughs> really like this uh, title screen though for the PlayStation version. And it has its own little tune and more aliens more accurate to the original, I guess. Like a floater and snake uh, man XCOM. I, I do like this I do like this title theme though. Yeah. Surprised nobody has supported that one yet to open XCOM. That's a good title to end this on. 25 years <laughs> since. Yeah. If you find me on, I still hate chrysalids. <laughs> kind of curious if this is a video with original or open X call. I think this is. Oh, crap. I pressed another button. Now we lost oh, the video right, forever. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. This one is open X call, at least. I was curious if the other one. Let's see. Oh, just this somehow, is... some. This one's. Uh, 2019. It might be open XCOM, yeah. Let's see. Curious. Now, whenever I see old videos of XCOM, I'm always curious if it's still the original or open XCOM. This one, I think, is all original. Yeah, it's all yeah I'm not versions. the zero time units button. Yeah, that's usually how I spot it, too, or the radar circles. And this was the Amiga version, which didn't have. If you thought. When people say original XCOM was. Took some hefty PCs to run the ports on lower end PCs like Amigas and stuff looked like this. Oh, there you are. That was the difference. Didn't look as great. Music was pretty good though. Low to in game was even worse. Oof. Loading times were rough. Yeah. Computers were rough back in the day. 
The PlayStation got a, got a got everything though. Amiga was mostly uh, less color than PUBG and stuff. But yeah. Okay. Well. That's good enough to end it on. We only have a Thank real you. win in the books. Yep. A real extra yeah. life win for the kids. We did it. <laughs> Even though we had disabled Psy at the end. Yeah. You know. yeah. Details. Details. Yeah. It's fine. Thanks it's everyone for online. watching. Thanks everyone that donated. All you went on the If you still want yeah, to donate, thanks for, thanks check the button donate. under the stream. And thanks Zero and Cans and everyone else that showed up. Uh, hey. I, 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 up I jumped in time. at the last minute. Yeah. I hopped in at the last minute, but it was still fun. Still fun. Yeah, I, I always keep this place chat over to anyone who wants to just... Some... Sometimes people think, oh, joining and stream and chatting and stuff is real. I can't do that. Just need to show up and say words. It's that simple. Um, yeah. I don't keep anyone in or out. Anyone who wants can just can hop on the Discord and hang around. I just thank Kaz and Zero, especially because they've been here from start to end. Jesus Christ, Kaz. Crazy. Crazy. Yeah. How Sleep is for humans. Yeah. yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah. I was like a half hour late anyway. <laughs> So yeah, see you next year, I guess, with something better yeah, next time, probably. That's a good plan. If I don't do any <laughs> other streams in the meantime, well, you can at least count on this one every year. So yeah, if you want to donate to kids, you got the link under, you got the link under yeah, the stream. Yeah, it's like page. Anything else, egg, cup and XCOM stuff, links again under the stream. Anything else you need, feel free to ask me. We have a Discord, you can get me there, talk to me in front of me. You can see it right here. <laughs> oh hey Scotch is back as well. He's all <laughs> has gone on I, I love it when these streams go so long that people go to bed and come back and I'm still here and they're like, oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Good times. Finally Good got stream. to see Sidonia on stream. Yeah. See ya. Fun stuff. See y'all. I'm gonna sleep forever now. And yeah, pretty much Good fine. Plan. Fine, yeah. Bye bye. See ya. Yeah. Yeah.